Yeah, yeah. I, I see something cooking in his yeah. eyes. I saw a little glisten. Yeah. Who? Me? No, in his eyes, a little Johnny? twinkle. Yeah. Johnny, you guys want to say? All right. No. Uh oh. <laughs> I'll say you go first. I just wanted to go first. Go ahead, Johnny. Yeah, I see Johnny. I see it. Yeah. It's Johnny. 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 I had six McMuffins. Damn! Bitch, tell let me see something. Oh, that Ooh, was I said, you ain't seen nothing. Damn. I with the knots. Uh, yeah. They eat the nuts food. Damn. I have fried chicken. Let's Damn. go. I ate all the food. Damn. Still hungry. All your Snoopy, 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 Snoopy. Yeah. Yeah. You about to go in? Now go ahead, Drew. Oh, all right. I should rock. Yeah. Watch me touch myself. Yeah. Oh, shit. Watch me touch myself. Watch me touch yeah. myself. Hey. If you a trans bitch, send me nudes. Yeah. Goddamn, don't be rude. Yeah. Show me that cock, you fat tranny. Yeah. Show me that cock, you fat tranny. Yeah. Put it in my face. Uh. I'll suck on the balls from underneath. Damn. Yeah. Goddamn. You so Damn. fat when you go to the beach, they say you a walrus. Damn. Yeah. I don't love my bitch no more. Facts. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Demonetize, demonetize, yeah. demonetize, demonetize. Yo, my girl. Gotta say that I love you. Damn. No, I don't. Oh shit. But I love you. Uh -huh. yeah. I love oh. when you cook my food and you stay in the kitchen. Stop bitching. Damn. Oh. God damn. Let's be honest. I am the prize. Yeah. Yeah. Put your stocks on the rise. Yeah. Yeah. You got yeah. big thighs. Yeah. Hey. Go ahead, Saul. Want me crib? Walk. 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 Okay. Yeah. Damn. Uh. Oh. Okay. Mm. I haven't freestyled in a minute. Yeah. She opened her legs and I spit it. She, I was fucking and she told me if I'm in it. I told you my dick's inside. Don't be discriminating. I told her back off. Cause my boys wanna get on. Damn. I know you the love, but I share the hoes for the bros. Damn. Gang, bang, gang, bang. We're checking. Gang, bang, gang, bang. Gang, bang, bang, gang, bang. Then we kill her. Then we kill her. Then we kill her. Then we kill her. Then we sacrifice. Then we hide the body inside the lake. And then put a dog six feet over so they can't find the body till you know it's over. And the dog's being Rover. Cause it like he know for the clover. This shit, God yeah. Damn, yeah. Hey, who's next? Yeah. Red Inspiring. Rover, Red Rover. Oh shit! Oh, I bend their fucking over. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I drive a Ram Rover. Hey. Oh. A Ram Rover. What yeah. the <laughs> fuck is a Ram Rover. Rover? You gotta hit the Ram Rover, Ram Rover, Ram Rover. Ram Rover. You guys were talking about murdering bitches. That's <laughs> yeah. crazy. Y'all were really specific on how you're gonna do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah. It's what it is though. Hold their nostrils while you slit their throat. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. And she's not alive, motherfucker. Are we not It's your boy, Anna Vine, I D or E from the M till I'm motherfucking Z. It's Johnny, what's up? It's your boy Gazelle. It's Beto. Yes, sir. We got a special guest today. We got the man, the legend, the owner of the Inland Entertainment Network. Yo. What's happening? What's up? What's up? Thank you guys for having me. What's happening? Yeah. Had a long time coming. It has to be here. It has been. What's up? What's popping? Long time coming. You just. Right off the river, talking about murdering bitches. That's yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. fit right in. That, you know, that's the secret of success. You know, murdering? killing bitches. Murdering. Yeah, sacrifice. You think? All right, like, hypothetically speaking. Yes. If we were to murder some bitch, <laughs> not my girl. <laughs> but would it be but they made us thirty minutes late. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, hypothetically speaking, though. Hypothetically. You, what's the most effective way to do it without getting caught? You think? I feel like you've watched some true crime shit. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. Into that. I even brought you guys like a book on how to kill people. Uh, shout out oh, you, bro. Shit. You brought yeah. <laughs> that a spooky, spooky basket. basket. That's, that's I got you guys spooky That's the first time a guest ever brought his shit. Step yeah. it up, guest. Oh, yeah. Come on. The fuck? Yeah. It's a, Ellie brought us a bottle. Oh, yeah, Ellie. Yeah. Shout out to homie Ellie. Shout out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody else, though? Come on, yeah, so. Oh, and and, 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 and Tony, the two. You brought Hennessy. All right, you know what? Um, a lot of you guys have brought shit. <laughs> a few of you guys have brought shit. So it's, a, it's a book of spells you can use for like sacrifices and shit. Oh, honestly, I saw Top Boss all Snickers in there. That should look cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's all the weekend, dude. It's all yeah. his sponsor shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's, it's all that they give me a bunch of stuff. So like, let me just start making spooky baskets. Is that Manscaped in there? Yeah. Okay. Nah, they uh, dropped us, bro. Damn. Oh, damn. Fuck them, bro. You don't need them. Oh, yeah. wait, wait. Don't hey, chill. Yeah. Yeah. Make shit sure out you guys use code POP for 20% off. Hell yeah. Damn, that's crazy they drop y'all. Yeah, they have, I, haven't, I haven't shaved my balls since. Damn. Yeah, what are we going to do? Fuck. Like, poof, I take off my pants. Damn, and then you got to wait two months to go to so the area. What's the most effective way, you think? To, like, kill someone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. To off somebody. From what I know, 
like this is already like how to hide the body or like kill someone have you guys thought Everything. about this like well, if, I have. like if you had to be in this situation and kill someone can you get away yeah, with yeah, it but yeah, not like after you chose it i'm like this guy's a dumbass i would have done it this way yeah. yeah i think the only way to kill someone without getting caught it has to be someone random like you just uh, like snipe that shit then you know just like that's yeah, true yeah. Okay, and that's just keep true. it going it's like yeah, why you walk on the street <laughs> yeah <laughs> I don't know. just go by your day mm. would you guys be like a like a murderer who leaves like clues and shit and so they no, can give yeah. you names nah, I know. I'm all, nah. you know I, I feel like all of us in here are already in this like I'm too lazy. We're already popping. We don't need the clout. What the right? oh. <laughs> need the clout. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, that, that's people who need, like, clout. That, that's not, every like, murderers, they're just, like, clout whores. Yeah. They're clout chasers. Yeah, yeah. yeah, they're clout chasers looking yeah. for attention. But if y'all want to come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, that would be come crazy. I, I've, yeah. been, I've been hoping for that. Yeah? But not like that, like that. Cause, well, okay, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> not because we have a... Your co-host like, I hope a lot of people die. <laughs> hey, explain. Explain yourself. <laughs> not because you've seen that one, uh, fuck, what's that dude? The one, his host is, like, the Beatle guy who was, like, what color is a carrot what's that guy's name uh, soldier boy yeah yeah soldier boy <laughs> no, but they had a, <laughs> i don't know the no, i don't know what you're talking about they had a psych they had like a killer like ho, like uh call howard in stern. The how yeah yeah howard stern oh beetlejuice oh uh, beetlejuice yeah, beetlejuice. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. not the character he said the yeah. beetle guy like, <laughs> yeah. the fuck? so i've been waiting for someone to send like a crazy call like that nah that's nuts. i murdered somebody <laughs> yeah i murdered i nah. murdered two prostitutes i heard there used to be a phone line that you could just call anonymously to and then just like a lot of people would just call in and just uh, air out their fucking dirty laundry. Oh, like confess? Uh, it's like a yeah. priest, 1 800 yeah, priest. Yeah. Kind of like that. that people, was a Pizza Hut. No, <laughs> yeah. calling a Pizza Hut, bro. That don't be venting Just unload pizza your hut. day and shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, fool's on the job. Like, what the fuck, bro? Uh, what, what's yeah, I kill like eight people. <laughs> what's crazy is that at the beginning, right when we started, he was like, oh, oh you got to sacrifice somebody for us to make it big, right? Yeah. Watch work. All of us are going to fucking make it big and they're going to clip that shit. And they're going to be like, that's Saul fucking <laughs> sacrifice. Saul. 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 Nah, Dad, as you want to know the secret, though? We sacrifice Saul. Shoot it. I got a secret. Bef right before the podcast blew up, and I, I was having sex with this one girl, oh. and uh, right when I was about a nut, shout out, shout out, government <laughs> <laughs> yeah. name. Right, right yeah. when I was about a nut, the only thing on my head was like podcast success. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, I heard about yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, sex manifestation. What? You know, who talks yeah. about that uh, that comedian Annie Annie Letterman. Uh -huh. He said that like, yeah, when you're about right when you're about a nut, you're supposed yeah. to manifest. Yeah, that's what I cook did. something. <laughs> <laughs> Cook better. Yeah. <laughs> oh, damn. I'm damn. tired of chicken and rice. Uh, damn. Just Just dry some, as fuck. Lose weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Stop bitching. Fuck. Y'all, y'all ever fucking record yourself uh, nutting? Yeah. <laughs> oh, what? what? No. <laughs> no. I, I've said like, some I wasn't videos. by myself. Yeah. yeah, yeah it no, was, cool. I was on, your, my on your own. You set up the camera, but then you like you watch your back, and while you're mid nut, you're like, oh, that's what yeah. I look like. Bro. I, I think you should have phrased it. Have you guys ever fuck, uh, recorded yourself fucking, and then you saw yourself nut, not recorded yourself nutting? Yeah, bro, like I your face reaction. Like yourself, no, I'm <laughs> specifically doing it <laughs> right. to see the nut face, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm girls love it. the nut face. You gotta send them the nut face. No, I don't think so. Bro. That's just looking yeah. ick. <laughs> Let me see. I'll tell you if it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no. show, show us, show us your face. That's hot. It's probably like I do a lot of grunting, but it's like it's, <laughs> it's fake, you know? Because <laughs> like I could. It's not, fake. It's not like it's fake. Yeah, cause you faking orgasms. <laughs> No, nah, I'm, sometimes I'm you nutting, got to, bro. Yeah. I'm nutting, but like I'm definitely like <laughs> you, you put some more oomph into it, you know? Yeah. <laughs> like when you're growing up, she don't need to go, ah, she don't yeah. need to do all that shit. She yeah. just she could just be quiet, honestly. Okay, damn. <laughs> oh. She really could. I feel like you guys could when you jack <laughs> Okay, don't look at me like I'm crazy. You when, are when you guys jack off, you're not in your room going, Oh, oh yeah! That's a damn lie. No, nah, 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 nah. you're not. But that's hey. because you're. It's embarrassing to jack off. Hey. You don't want nobody but else to you hear though. you. You nah. don't want anybody else to hear you. Fucking nut. Fuck you. Know you. Yeah, yeah, I live, yeah, I live no. with my parents, so I don't want them to hear me. <laughs> Fuck you, because I'm, I'm about a, to come. I'm a, I'm a performer. I, I, I hold my mouth and I'm about to nut. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way you can nut is like yeah. over his mouth. I'm yeah. biting the pillow and I'm nutting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But like, it's different because I don't like crinkle. Like <laughs> oh yeah, no, my toes are curling for sure. Oh, shit. Never ever jerk off in the fetal position. Yeah. No, you good, bro? Damn. <laughs> Damn. You good? Sometimes like, I do it face down. <laughs> okay. Ass, Ass up, up <laughs> man. I'm getting doggy by myself. Oh, hell you know, my girl got me one of those. Uh, what are the Theraguns? What are they called? The Theraguns. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the Theraguns? Yeah, Pocket yeah. pussies. I looked at his shoes like, yeah, because you know you'd be getting cramps. I'm like, I can't put that shit. I can't wait to put that shit on my ass, bro. Hey, <laughs> have, you, have you ever played like Call of Duty and gone on a private match and then got in a light machine gun and then like started shooting it and put it on your what? dick? Oh, yeah. Nah, bro, I've never done that. When I was little. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, neither, neither have I. Neither, <laughs> I was nah, neither, neither, neither have I. Neither have I. Halo, yeah. Halo. Now, uh, Terry, come on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. shit. What were we, oh, yeah, murdering people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but show me your nut face, Lalo. <laughs> I, I just go like I, don't, oh. I haven't recorded myself like this because I know this face. Well, just make it. the face right now, like pretend you had one, and then just. just oh, that one. I'll be thinking. Lalo, just just jack off real quick. We'll wait for you to nut. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then, and then we'll, run we'll over cut, here and we'll just we'll just cut it until when you nut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. This is it right here. No, nah, stop it. For, for the audio <laughs> listeners, mm. Lalo's jacking off right now. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine nutting <laughs> and you're like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> having a brainstorm yeah. session. Yeah. <laughs> well, what can we do? My best ideas. What am I gonna eat today? I feel like nut faces are never good. Yeah, yeah like, I don't think so. Like, no, that's facts, bro. I be looking on the spectrum and shit when I fucking. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I said that. Easy on Saul's yeah, episode. Yeah, that's crazy. Episode, that's Damn. Crazy. Yeah, I never thought about. I mean, it internet, place. duh, spectrum, internet. How many? Hey, have you guys thought about this? Because this is a real shit. Is real shit. Uh, you guys put yourselves out there. Maybe you guys have some like like listeners, some fans. Yeah. Hello. Who like get like horny to you guys' shit? Oh yeah. shit! You ever thought I about? Know, they bro. might be like. Either like jerking their dick or like what their the pussy. Fuck? What the f- I thought a pussy. That's I fire. thought a pussy was coming out of your mouth, but yeah. a dick. I yeah, know yeah, for yeah. a fact that happens because one sure. time this dude sent me a, a a video of him fucking his girl. Oh shit! Uh, yeah, yeah, he told me. Oh, yeah, he just say that. I have yeah. a. He didn't finish though. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I, like, what a I was like, link. Want- <laughs> <laughs> link. link. Now nah, he wants to tag you in, bro. Yeah. He's like, you got to finish the job. He said part two for the. Yeah. I don't know about the OF. I don't know about that, but for sure, I feel like for both of our podcasts, like. For sure, somebody's been fucking right, and the podcast is in the background. Yeah, mm. bro, I think about this. Think about all this shit laugh. that goes on in the background while your podcast Fuck. is playing. Yeah. For Low sure, key, someone's huh? been in a car accident while your podcast yeah. is playing. Yeah, you that, think so? For sure, like they're probably upside. Oh down. yeah, I crashed and yeah. shit. I was listening to our podcast. Yeah. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, 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 how about we? How about we just fuck with them in the episode? Hey, I see you fucking. They're like, yeah. what the <laughs> fuck? Hey, bro, those Look straight into the camera. <laughs> hey, I'm just letting you know, like I, me, I would have gone a little deeper. Your 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 boy's not putting in. Damn, that's crazy. Hey, wow. shout out to everybody that's fucking right now in this fucking moment. Hey, right bro, now. Yeah. Just go to the camera. Hey, I'll see you. Actually, right now, if you're not fucking, start fucking. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Enjoy right. two inches, bitch. Yeah, Enjoy yeah. two inches. Bow, bow, yeah. bow, we'll, bow. Co- we'll coach you through the whole thing. Yeah, we'll coach you. It, what is it? It's, it's J-O-I. Some, yeah. some yeah, 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 jerk yeah. off instructions. I just learned that. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> I've been to that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one who taught it. Yeah. Yeah. That's disgusting. Yeah. Crazy. Uh, well, welcome back to another episode. Uh, oh. Hey, you know, you, have you guys ever seen that fucking... Um, no. He says he just brought up jack off instructions. That's obviously <laughs> important, right? Yeah. Have you guys ever seen Mom, that? you could click off now. <laughs> <laughs> like, now we've been talking about murdering yeah. and yeah. faces. Yeah. Right, now, Mom. Mom. Yeah, cool. now. Now, have, y'all, have y'all ever seen that one dude who does like the the casting, but not the not the original dude, not the one that's on the, what do they call it? Casting couch. Casting couch. You're talking the other dude, the dude that wears the fucking, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Soldier Boy. No. <laughs> Beetlejuice. <laughs> the punk. <laughs> No, well, bro, well, like well, that punk because he wears a fucking big ass. Oh, helmet. marshmallow! Oh, right? <laughs> Damn, no, right. he's not. You know <laughs> what I'm talking about, right? Hey, Gibby the, have you seen Gibby the Clown? Whoa. No, what are you talking about? Wild. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Search no. that shit up. Just yeah. <laughs> there's some dude who fucks <laughs> girls and like high end porn stars, but he wearing he's wearing like a fucking a helmet, not a helmet. Fuck, that sounds crazy, huh? <laughs> a mask. A mask. It's like Halloween for him, but all the time. Oh. Give me the clown, you know, bro. You, you guys never seen this guy? No. I'm gonna pull him up, bro, because I just sound crazy. This is Put a him on the screen wait, right wait, now. Wait, wait, um, I'm are you talking pull, about? Um, I'm gonna pull him up. That's I'll pull him wild. up. Oh, what's his name? His name is um. What's he, crazy? John Gazelle's always telling us these stories of like this fucking sexual shit, and that he can never find it. So let's yeah. see if he's nah, able to find and then, it. And then he always ends up going, "Oh, I can't find his stupid fucking browser." No, I know because he's fucked that one bitch, Violet Myers. Oh, hey, I just saw Violet Myers in person. That us? Oh, really? Oh, she man. better in person. Dog, she's gorgeous. Yeah. I nutted Ooh. seeing her. <laughs> is it Adam 22? <laughs> no, no. Is it Adam 22? Why the fuck would it be Adam 22? Because he fucked her. That's crazy. They got did, this bitch huh? fucking yeah. bent like a pretzel. <laughs> <laughs> She's bent like a fucking pretzel. Look at her. God. <laughs> You're looking at kicks and shit? She's doing fucking sit You're just getting hard over here. Yeah, hey, you want to show? I can't find it, but. Gazelle, you want to show us or you want to watch a video? <laughs> We're gonna take a quick break. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> we all come back like, oh shit. Oh, I'm all, I'm tired. <laughs> all calm. Yeah. I guess I'll just go with your video and show your face. <laughs> I'm gonna find this shit, bro. Because you guys look like. Look they don't look like it. Okay, it, looks, just, it looks like you're finding your favorite. Just sign into my account. I mean. Oh my god. There, there, there he is. Look at him. That's it? Ooh. Look at this motherfucker. <laughs> you look, that's, that's why I look my <laughs> <laughs> Pass it around. Pass it around. Yo, he looks like that rocket power dude. 
Oh, I seen that guy. <laughs> yeah, come on, bro. Why didn't you <laughs> fucking help me out? They look like no, Chucky. I didn't from, remember the they video. They look like Chucky from Rugrats. But right now that I saw the orange, there's no way you haven't seen right now, him, bro. It's hey. like it's like Hooters, huh? Gazelle, yeah, that's my favorite. It look, it look <laughs> show Beto, show Beto. Play it, we'll play it. <laughs> no, no hey, Gazelle, it look like Chucky from Rugrats, right? Yo, that's badass. Bro, he fucks like some of the highest end porn stars, but it's like you is can't. Is Paulie a real porn star though? Oh, is that no, it, oh, he oh, is. Oh, really? Is he a porn star? No, I, thought he was a ass, I thought he was a big ass doll. I mean, he's a, uh, like a. <laughs> or like he's an established no. porn star. Like he's been doing it. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's it, what I'm saying. But why? Why add that into the mix? I don't get it. Obviously, you're over. You're talking about it, right? Yeah. Dreams. <laughs> hey, bump that shit up. <laughs> Turn that shit off. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, she about to get on. Hey, that's a really good mask. Giddy up, giddy up. It's a great mask, but I'm just like dreaming. Okay, 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 bro. bro. Did you see him? Even, I haven't seen it. He's not even fucking yet, bro. It take forever. Right, let, let no, yeah, they did. There's like a whole ass interview. Hey, bro. I, hey, do you guys like the fucking build up to the story, or do you guys just want to want to get straight into it? I'm selfish. Oh. Story. Yeah. No, I like the I like a little bit of build up. I'm not gonna lie. Really? <laughs> the fuck, <bro>? All right, bitch. <laughs> All right, bitch. You, guys, you guys hear the leather? <laughs> okay, for those of you who don't know, it's just my chair moving. I it? can't stop it. I, hey, tell them what, <laughs> tell them what to type in Pornhub so they can go look it up. What for the uh, listeners? If, if you okay. don't type. So try porn dude casting, but also you could put in bubble ass of Violet Myers. <laughs> Just jumping on porn dude's dick. Black, 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 black. <laughs> Shoot it. I recommend it. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Hold on, let me show them. Okay. Uh, now, nah, yeah, but I need a little bit of build up. You say yourself, or you just get straight into it? Or yeah, what? I just got into it. Just, oh, what the? Nah. nah just like, yeah, you're wild then, bro. I just Pleaser. gotta I, get that shit done. I need to know if they're gonna get caught or not. Like, you know, like brother, sister. Like, I, I need to know what's Is going it really on. her stepbrother? Like, yeah, like, right. I, I need to know. Yeah. I feel it. And the end when they get caught, like I want to see that, you know, because it says brother gets caught. I want to see that getting caught. <laughs> this is just a POV, bro. <laughs> no, I bitch. don't see his face but at all. Oh up. yeah, well yeah, but there's we, yeah, well, it shifts. It shifts. There's definitely angles where like you see him with a big ass mask and he's just getting it. It's <laughs> <laughs> just crazy to me, bro. What's that? What's the aperture on that? All I see is her, bro. I dead ass have don't see him. Look at the thumbnail. So fast forward. Oh, okay. Hey, you know you can fast forward, bro, right? I am. And I like and all, I, all I see is ass. Look at his dick. That's just hey, nice. cut the shit out. My girl's gonna be mad at me. <laughs> Can you watch porn? You can't watch porn, Beto. You guys don't oh, like the sacky brother. balls when you're watching. Bro, hey, Beto, tell her that. Like, uh, oh, oh, shit, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> looks That's like, like a whole ass fucking big ass mask. Looks like Chucky from uh, Rugrats. Yeah. It just looks fuck like him. you. I no, I know. That's what I'm saying. I was just saying what you said. Yeah. yeah. I think it looks like Chucky from Rugrats. All right. Actually, can I go to the restroom real quick? I'm oh, yeah, going to jerk off. Oh, okay. What the fuck? Oh, that's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> nah, but I'm going to go. Okay, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, see, see. I know. I fucking, I'm a bitch when it comes to drinking. Really? Yeah. yeah. I, one I, modelo. <laughs> no, I, well, I had a bunch of drinks before. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> All right, y'all. We're back from the bathroom break. We're back. I know what my nut face looks like. I just yeah. want to go confirm. Dr Dreams and Saul went into the bathroom together. I don't know what happened. Yeah, that shit still hurts, dog. What the fuck? <laughs> That's Damn. crazy. You gotta bro. warn people when you drop the hammer like that, bro. You ain't Thor. <laughs> <laughs> we recorded it all, so stay tuned for the Patreon. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Be members only. Members, members only, only on YouTube. If you know, you know. Yeah. You know? Yeah. All right. What were we talking about? I don't remember. Uh, but then we said how you could murder somebody. <laughs> nah, that was. I think that was. <laughs> that was way before, yeah, yeah. no? <laughs> you missed the whole thing. Yeah. Like Johnny. Johnny just woke up. Huh? Like, <laughs> I, got a, I got a question. Oh, sure. All right. So on your last podcast, you guys were talking about billionaires. Yeah, and you're oh, okay. really you're really defending billionaires, yeah, but yeah, I saw yeah. I saw something in you where it's like, I uh, you're defending them, but not just to defend them. I feel like you know, what are your goals? Because I feel like you, I think you know you're gonna be a billionaire for sure. You, oh, you see yourself as a billionaire, one hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Damn, yeah. you be nutting, just be like billionaire. That's my manifest here. It's like yeah. oh, billionaire. Oh, <laughs> That's right. Bezos, Bezos. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Elon right. Musk, Jeff Jeff Bezos. Bro, I just want to get me to my next check. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to pay Come these on. bills. Come on, direct deposit. <laughs> I'm just trying to smash. For, okay, <laughs> I just want my nut. Uh, nah, but yeah, I, uh, I mean that's that's a dream. No, like no. just everybody wants more money. But if you if you you can't just say you want more money. You have to put a goal. Yeah. So you have to set goals. So my goal is like, well, I want to be a billionaire. I want to have that money. But I'm not gonna be like those fucked up. I'm gonna be a good billionaire. Be a nice yeah. billionaire, you know. Yeah, because <laughs> the podcast I was watching, Aaron was like, "Nah, fuck those billionaires." Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're like, "Yo, like, what's wrong with billionaires? You know, I want to be a billionaire." And I can tell, like, you really believe yeah. you're gonna be a billionaire. So that's For why sure. that's why I'm bringing it up. Nah, and nice. you find that funny or what? Do you think you can? <laughs> do you think you can? <laughs> no. See, I, I like self-made billionaires. Yeah. yeah. That's why I fuck with like. Uh, well, actually, I was about to fuck. Never mind. I was about to say I fuck with Logan Paul because he's self-made. But like, yeah, there's he's things. He does questionable yeah
like first generation huge mm -hmm. respects yeah so that's why i know like i know there's all the people like oh who cares about billionaires like they have all that money who cares about their feelings right but at the end of the day like money ain't shit at the end of the day, it's like whatever yeah. you feel so do you think it's even possible to become like a billionaire like ethic ethically yeah. like yeah. there's a lot of people that make that argument like there's no way that you even attain this type of wealth if you don't do some fucked up shit to get to it like you gotta screw people over or you gotta like yeah like touch kids yeah well <laughs> yeah. Hey, I, hey, whatever you want. Uh, <laughs> you know I mean? <laughs> that's like, that's like Jeffrey Hypstein shit. Yeah, I was like, I know yeah, like, do you. <laughs> to each their own. Hey, you know? I, I wouldn't, but that's just me. But what do yeah, I know? Yeah, yeah, I, was, I was with the first part, but he's with the second part. I was gonna dive you up, and you got me second. Like, so I had to. I, I, yeah, right? Yeah. I, I, I think you meant like pushing people, but I mean, you know, that shit got you guys real quiet for like two seconds. Like, touch your kids. Yeah, chamo, chamo. <laughs> that's a good question can you be like ethically uh, ethical billionaire i think you can like now with like social media i'm pretty yeah. sure you can yeah. uh you might hurt feelings yeah. with some people because i know some people want to like work together but at the end of the day it's you and your family's best interest yeah so uh, i don't i don't know there's people that are just born into it too like born into being a billionaire and like yeah. the, that's why i'm like when people make that argument like how, how could you be an ethical billionaire i'm like people do that all the time they're just born into it sometimes you know that yeah. too, there's a lot of generational wealth yeah. that but i it's also up. about if you like revolve yourself around billionaires like if you get to that point like if, even if you're not making that money like those fools are because a lot of billionaires give each other fucking money yeah yeah have Ooh. you heard of that shit like oh like, my best friend's a billionaire yeah. you're not getting there by having those kind of friends yeah even just by that knowledge they give like yo yeah. bro, put some money in the stock i guess so one way that can be fucked up like ethically they you know because they manipulate the market all the time yeah. so they'll be like hey bro so we're doing this shit with the stock market take all your money out put your money in we're gonna make that yeah. shit happen oh, like mm -hmm. a pump and dump yeah so i guess oh, yeah. tech like ethically i guess i can see once you're in a position where people have power and they can manipulate things yeah. to make you more money then I can see where it gets Well, it's popular. crazy too because I didn't know for the longest time that politicians are able to like buy into stock into the stock market. Yeah. And that's why like they say like most of like, for example, Nancy Pelosi, like her number, her money, a lot of it comes from like earnings and shares from the stock market. Yeah. And I'm like, how is that a How is that even legal, bro? Like how do you guys? Yeah, it's like her but, husband does the trading and the, but she has information and gives her husband and shit yeah. like that. Yeah. So but, it's like, yeah. but the, so, the social media thing that you brought up, like ethically, like Mr. Beast, right? That's a pretty good example. Yeah, how yeah. He's like, he's, from what I hear, he's on the road to becoming a billionaire. Yeah. Like, he's really close. And I, I mean, he's, he there. seems like a fucking, you know, ethically good yeah. guy. So yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think so. Just cause that social media, the new path of social media, because all it is, if you have enough people watching you, if you have enough people buying your shit, then you can yeah. make it. Mm -hmm. But also, I, I, honestly, I don't know how much a billion is. So maybe I'm underestimating it. Yeah. Like maybe multi-million. You can probably be a multi-millionaire yeah. ethically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you get a billionaire, then you probably got... Uh -huh. Do some you gotta shit. stomp on some toes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Touch some kids. Fuck you, man. That's a lot. Of, <laughs> that's a lot of fucking money, bro. It is. Yeah. That's if you lot. think about it, like it's crazy. Oh, it's a million billions. A million a thousand, billions. A thousand. No. <laughs> a thousand millions. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. A thousand million. Yeah. No, that's a hundred. That's. Oh no. Yeah. A thousand. A thousand millions, millions is a billion. A thousand millions. Damn. It's yeah. a lot of money. Yeah. Crazy. I can't even get to a thousand. <laughs> <laughs> Give me my paycheck, bro. <laughs> well, think about I it, bro. There's, I live paycheck. To like, pay like, like, there's, there's like actors for years, the biggest, and there's like four million. Like, bro, how? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just crazy. Oh, yeah, and also, yeah, like, yeah, it's, yeah. this is like the spending shit. Like, you're going to make yeah. a lot of money, so you want to buy a bunch of cool shit. So, like, technically, all these awesome. rich people, they could have reached the billion if they didn't buy these big yeah. ass houses and shit. Did you ever, did you see the uh, person that won that lotto ticket for like the jackpot? Yeah. He bought a fucking house? Oh, they did? I don't know. Yeah, I just said it was in Orange County. Like, that fool's been spending it like crazy? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. What's the I thing, think, what's the first thing you do when you like win a billion dollars? House, property. Like, you, I'm you walking around the house. dollars? He didn't take all one billion. He got taxed like half a billion. Yeah. Because yeah, so, he took yeah. it all at once. Yeah. That's smart. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so he has like a... He has like 500 million. People always there. say that too. Oh. He's broke. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, broke ass dude. What the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. Get your money up. Yeah. But yeah, people always say, because there's an option like this where you can get paid out over time. Over time. Yeah. Never and take that shit. That's stupid, bro. I could die tomorrow. Now you're going to die. People are going to come after your head if yeah. you're that rich. Yeah. They're coming for you. So it's like, I don't know. I, first thing I'm doing, if I want a billion dollars, I'm walking around the house naked. Mm. Everybody got to see it. Mm. I do that, Everybody I do that and I'm poor. This made you. <laughs> this made you. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. fuck. I don't know. I feel like that, that's wild as fuck because like this dude bought a $300 million house and it's like 
t- you got to maintain the house, pay all these bills. That fool don't think of that shit. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people don't know. You got to mow the lawn. You got to. You need employees for the so house. So much shit, bro. Yeah. Like it's so expensive. Well, isn't it like a statistic, like seventy or I don't know, some crazy ass statistic? Where it's like, yeah, a lot of people that win the lottery end up going back to being broke. Again. Yeah, We're not yeah. broke, but losing all the money. Like be smart, bro. Build, just build your own modest house yeah. for like five hundred k. Because everyone says the same shit: invest, invest. Like everyone knows to invest, but like yeah. invest in what and so, how? Well, that's what you revolve yourself around, businessman. And yeah, if you're yeah. at the you're at the status with that kind of money. Yeah, but you, it's hard when you were like a fucking a uh, clerk at CVS. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, you now, know, honestly, and now you're, you're trying to be with like, billionaires. If you're like, if you have, it's all about the mindset. Because if you have a broke mindset when you're rich, you're still gonna be broke. Yeah, like because one thing that i learned the hard way was like i remember when i was younger i was super into business i'm like when i get money i'm gonna invest in this when i do this and this and that yeah and then like a couple months ago i just found myself at the strip club like almost every week (laughs) (laughs) and i was like you don't have a dad (laughs) (laughs) so i was like okay fuck Right, so I had gotta the, be quicker than that. Yeah, so I had the broke mindset for a minute because I was like, damn, I have all this money, but now I want to, I want to, I want to spend it. Yeah, because yeah, you didn't have it. Yeah. Yeah. So technically, you still like not, you're not there yet. So yeah, something I learned. You're not, you're it's not, so much, it's so much harder. You're not okay. mentally rich, right? Yeah, yeah, you're not mentally rich. Like when you're broke, you're like, oh, I'm gonna be smart. You get the money? Eh, it's okay. No, yeah, cause yeah, cause <laughs> when you're broke, you're like, yeah, I'm a, when I do this, I'm gonna get it. But then when you finally have it, you going you want to enjoy it. But then you start. Down pasando. You're like, oh shit, yeah. there's a little bit too much. I'm spending that shit. Bro. Yeah, yeah, it's I tough. Am. Yeah, and I live on I, that. I live on that thing. Like, what if the world ends? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm spending yeah. that shit. I'm, I'll be part of that st- statistic. <laughs> 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 I, I you guys know. hear Gazelle fool yeah. all his money, bro? <laughs> Did you guys hear Hong Kong expanded? <laughs> <laughs> they're international now. Yeah, it's crazy. National. I don't know if you guys seen too how he looks. He doesn't look like the brightest person. Either. Nah. Yeah. So he it looks like a Twitch, like a yeah. like your average Twitch. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Twitch streamer or just some dude that twitches. Yeah. Dude that watches. <laughs> fuck. He does both. Yeah. He twitches and he twitches. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. That's okay. That's bars. No, I feel like if you want to fucking like. Lottery. Six listeners you're, though, you're, huh? You're, 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 <laughs> hey, I think eight. Uh, you're, you're able to revolve yourself around billionaires because who's not gonna want to kick you with you? You're gonna get invited to a lot of shit because you know you're gonna spend your money. Yeah, I yeah. I know it could look be looked down upon too. Like, oh, this fool didn't make his money like we did. You know, like those other billionaires. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And be like, this fool just won the lottery. So fuck it, those fools. But but it's like, interesting no though. Yeah, People yeah. are gonna want to be with you. Like, like oh, this fool's cool. Like, but a just five minute talk. But to fuck know. you over because they're like, hey, bro, you should invest in this. Polly, Polly. Yeah. So you're a billionaire, hypothetically. All of you guys are high. Are Hypothetical billionaire. Dropping you guys, Bruno Cap. What is the one thing that you gotta have? I'll get, put it all on red. Getting <laughs> out the IE. <laughs> you, you get out the IE, but you're like in Banning. Yeah. Like you're, you're like in Pomona. Yeah. I'm in Cabazon. Yeah. Yeah. with that, bitch. Oh, shout out uh, P Town. Shout out P Town. But uh, you guys are hypothetical billionaires. What's the one thing that you gotta have in your house? A bidet. Like the one. <laughs> Oh, you got a bidet. A bidet in the fridge. A nah. fridge. <laughs> if, if I'm that rich, somebody eating my ass after every time I eat shit. <laughs> they on. Put that out. They on payroll. Yeah. You're fuck. like, Jeeves. And he comes, he's like, you know what to do. And he's like, yes, sir. <laughs> What yeah. accent is that? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Some dude from fucking. No, it's a guy pretending to have an accent. Oh, okay. Because you can afford oh, to pay for that. Oh, yeah, you got an actor to eat your ass. Yeah. Uh, let me think. Uh, first thing I, thought you have. I gotta like for me for example I gotta have a theater I gotta have like a hidden theater somewhere like uh, just a fucking like like finally have some place where everyone can watch the fights or like uh, yeah, yeah. the Super Bowl we're still oh, streaming yeah. illegally yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> crack streams crack and shit streams, it's like Kanye baby. he like be yeah. on Reddit for OnlyFans yeah. that, like, that's oh, me yeah. it's like a Facebook live but they're trying to sell dogs yeah. they're like oh look at this <laughs> oh, oh yeah we're watching that this. happened one time one time we were trying to stream uh, one time we were trying to watch a fight yeah. and not the well, you fight. bought it. That's the bullshit part about it. Yeah, you bought I did. it, but Showtime. Stupid Showtime. Kept, it was the Logan kept, Paul fight versus KSI, up. the the first one. Yeah. Dreams bought it and um but Showtime was just the app was just fucking working. Oh, so we had it, on the it crashed. So we went on Facebook Live and yeah. we're watching it and some dude's like talking <laughs> during the fight. And it's in the bag. And he's yeah. also like, also, if you guys want to buy fucking pit bulls. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, you guys want to bully, they should go on 1500. Like, yeah. All the comments are like, bro, put the fucking fight <laughs> yeah. back on. Yeah. Adding commercials to his stream. Yeah, literally. No. Yeah, yeah, bro. But so. I, for me, I got to have a theater. I think that's just like the one thing I have to have. I yeah. don't care. 
Yeah. I'll, I'll probably have like an indoor soccer field or something. Damn, like, fuck wow. yeah. That'd be oh, sick. That's that. hard, We're always going to be over there. Yeah. yeah, right. You got an indoor <laughs> soccer field here if you want. I want a, <laughs> I want an indoor. Uh, you guys ever seen those commercials, those Taco Bell commercials? Yeah. Where, like the football players have like an indoor Taco Bell? Yeah. You know, you know what I'm talking about? I know. Or am I like, fucking crazy? No, I've heard about that. Okay. No, no they're commercials. Yeah. Yeah. I'll have a Taco Bell inside my. No, it, <laughs> it wouldn't even be a Taco Bell. It'd be a George's Burgers. Damn. It's like some mom and pop spot. No, I'd want a theater, bro, or a fucking, for sure, a gym. Like a, a legit one fuck though. That. I still wouldn't go, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I that still just, just be paying the membership. Like, yeah. fuck, that's so just food just like dusting and shit. Yeah. Like he ain't use this bench yeah. press in a minute, bro. You get mad when people use it though. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I was gonna use that. Yeah, it's like your uh, son. Like, fuck, get the fuck out of here. There's yeah. still some bitch at the squat rack. You're just like, bitch, hurry up. <laughs> you, you hire actors to make it like a real experience at the yeah. gym. Still dudes hugging up the basketball yeah. court. <laughs> oh, your own pad. You just leave. Crazy. You oh, gotta, you gotta yeah, the that's hot for me. That's I, what about for you guys? Probably a man cave. A man cave? <laughs> Don't call it a man cave though. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? That's Why an egg, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Toxic masculinity. That's not gender neutral. Yeah, that's not gender. <laughs> <laughs> it's an X cave. Yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's, it's an X cave. It's, it's a they cave. them cave. It's an us cave. Yeah, it's an us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A we cave? <laughs> it's their it's their yeah, cave. Yeah. 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 That would a man cave too. That's probably you. I'll probably have a Nintendo Wii in that bitch. Yeah. What about you, Johnny? Oh, we'll man. finally have space. We'll put, have a Wii, but we'll finally have space to actually do the. You know, yeah. like when the, you would play the Wii, it would say, like, leave enough space in the room <laughs> so you're not fucking. Yeah. <laughs> We're only not knocking shit. Yeah. And I'm not putting that strap on. <laughs> oh, I ain't putting bag. that strap on. I'm yeah, fucking yeah. freeballing it with the Wii remote. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I did that one time, but I, I fucking ruined one of the homies. Um, little side. Oh. You, know, you know those uh, the old style things, uh, shelves with a clear glass and you cl you push it in it clicks in and it goes yeah. out yeah. fucking busted his shit bro <laughs> my mom had those dumb ass shits bro <laughs> Put a handle on them shits. Yeah. Put a handle on them shits. Yeah. You gonna complain to me oh, about staining up the glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They sell them at yeah. Walmart and shit. They're, yeah, you push yeah, them yeah. and it, it comes out and shit. You yeah. gonna complain to me about staining up the glass. Why don't you just put a handle on it, dumbass? <laughs> Wild. <laughs> you just, but yeah, I, I fucking, I was, I was bowling. Fuck yeah, then I had to <laughs> You were bowling. I, 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 I let yeah. that shit go. I just fucking rolled on the. On, I threw hard, too. Uh, and I just fucking bowled. I remember, we used to play <laughs> fucking, we used to play FIFA on the Wii. That shit was kind of <laughs> stupid. Yeah, you, the room, like, the fuck yeah. you, you like shoot like yeah. that, but it wouldn't read it. And you're like, yeah. fucking shoot. You nice. put the Wii control tied to your ankle and shit. <laughs> yeah. my, my, my dad was super into that shit, into the FIFA on Wii. And yeah. this one would fucking curve the ball. He'd be like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when you do the boxing floor, I get into yeah, that shit, Yeah, bro. I start sweating. Oh, I keep getting knocked out by that black one. <laughs> <laughs> I do. He's good, he's good. That he's motherfucker good. be fucking me up, bro. With the mustache and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah the yeah, ball yeah. with the same Fred or some shit. That yeah. shit would piss me off. I'd get racist, bro. Just <laughs> cut, that wow. shit. cut that shit out. No, don't cut it out. Leave it in. <laughs> oh, yeah. Leave it in. That's like a joke. Yeah. 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 Clip it. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna clip it, bro. Yeah. Or but when you play fucking baseball and that shit, and the motherfucker looks at you when you keep missing the switch. Yeah. <laughs> you remember that shit? Yeah, you go, right. you miss, and he be like, at the yeah. camera. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna swing? Yeah. Fuck Ball. <laughs> Ball, yeah. Fuck, Fuck that food. What'd you want, Johnny, in your mansion? In mine, um, I'd probably want an indoor pool. Oh, even though I can't swim, you don't even know how to tight. swim. But I'm a billionaire. I'm a learner to yeah. swim. Hey, Johnny, just get a pool, but it's all just four feet high. <laughs> <laughs> the whole oh, thing. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be sick. It's Shamu's enclosure. Like, uh, all right, that'd be sick. Uh, six listeners. Uh, six listeners. Six, 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 six listeners. Some bullshit. <laughs> Can you, yeah, you know, damn, I'll be bumping infinite dreams in the background though. Yeah. Um, Crazy. No, nah, I, I feel like a pool would be dope. Uh, a chef, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, I chef. for sure would want to. Yeah, that's true. That's a game changer, bro. My dog. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have to worry about shit. That's how people stay healthy. I still yeah. eat out, bro. It's gonna be a female. It's gonna be a female <laughs> too. You get, you get the chef to bring you in and out. Yeah. Like, hey, can you bring that shit? <laughs> He's a chauffeur. Yeah. <laughs> He's not even a chef no more. He's like, you know, I can cook this shit, yeah. dog. Nah, nah, nah. No, I, like it. I like when the fries are soggy in the bag. Yeah. yeah. Bro, same drive through. I want Jack. <laughs> Just go get it, bro. I yeah. thought about that before. Paid. Like, you don't get paid to talk. Cause like right now, right? <laughs> I, I don't. I don't live with my girl, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, so, what? Bro, yeah. that's crazy. That's wild. So, don't you love her? Girl or sex slave? My girl. <laughs> She's just in a cage for fun, bro. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, but like, Bark. what do you do? <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> She's on a <the> leash. <laughs> like, what do you do when you just want like a fucking late night fucking double double? Yeah, you buy an internet. Oh, like yeah, because like you'd be craving girl, that shit, like, right? Yeah. Yeah. And like, she don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. she lives in her pad, and I just want to go get a double double. I'll go get a fucking double double. Who gonna tell yeah. me shit? Yeah. But yeah. when I live with her, she's gonna be like, I made dinner. Like, yeah. shut up, bitch. <laughs> or or, or she's gonna be like. I don't want anything. You come back. That looks good. 
<laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> are you? Honey's hella pissed about it. Right. Are she gonna yeah, think it looks a little. I should have fucking brought you one, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I asked you if you wanted one. Fuck, bro. <laughs> so you got a girl? Nah. Oh, Damn. Damn. It's a podcast, bro. I don't know. I'm just, I mean, the podcast doesn't. It's is doesn't it better allow. to be single? For real? Yeah. That's why you're single because of the podcast. Nah, nah. Well, yeah, because of the podcast. I say some shit. Yeah. So just, like, like to make content, like I wanted, to, like we get personal. So we say some shit. So I'm like, oh yeah. So I was with this one girl last night, mm. and then the girls will text me like, who was that? Yeah. And then so it just starts a lot of problems. Oh, okay. But, uh, so who? Was you it? just gotta start saying you're with men. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I <laughs> fucked this guy last Sorry. night. <laughs> Also, the girl that dropped, that? Also, the girl that dropped you off is just a friend. Yeah. Hey, oh, yo. Oh. <laughs> is his mom, too? Who's his mom? Uh, oh, I pay for everything, huh? Yeah. So who's the bitch with the linebacker shoulder? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. She was bad. Like, oh, that's your type? Yeah. So, no, so that's your type? Yeah, yeah. She, so she sucked good dick, trust yeah, yeah, yeah. She's like, see you later, yeah. soul. Yeah. <laughs> Smacks my ass. Uh, uh. Damn. No, I used to have a bit like mashed potatoes. <laughs> what the fuck, then? <laughs> Yeah, nah. It's I think it's better. It's being better being single right now. You yeah. could just focus Fox. all your energy on the pod too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just cry at night. That's it. Oh, Low yeah. key. That's, that's, mm-hmm. You'll get over here. Yeah, man. I get over there. You just, just jerk it. off and yeah, yeah. You good? Go to sleep. That. Just cry through your dick instead. Fuck that. <laughs> that. That way he can manifest on many girls too. Like, every time he's about a nut, yeah, he just yeah. manifest on the podcast. Yeah. On uh, Becky girls. G. Uh. <laughs> that's not gonna go well over when you ask her to come on <laughs> <laughs> bro I say that I'm like but honestly Becky she probably wouldn't the shit I say like I, she, she's not gonna come on but yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> one day bad. one day the, this is weird I'm you, not going are on you big in on uh, manifestation then yeah yeah 100%, yeah, yeah. And you say it's, it's worked out for you yeah uh, uh, and if it hasn't worked out it's gonna work out okay so I don't well, put a time limit when did you when did you start getting into that uh, fucking junior year. You got I'll, crystals and shit. Or? Nah, I was in, <laughs> nah. Hey yo, what the fuck? <laughs> What's wrong with that? Hey, yo, what the fuck? Not your girl. Oh, okay. uh, uh, not junior year in my yeah. theater class. <laughs> it was weird. You just got it. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, in my theater class, there's one guy. He was doing a monologue about the movie The Secret. Mm-hmm. I don't know if you guys seen that on mm-hmm. Netflix. Mm-hmm. It's like a. It's basically the intro to manifestation. Mm-hmm. And he was talking about it. And me and my friend, we just started making fun of him. Like, oh, the secret, the secret. Yeah. And then I was like, Loki, wait, this guy kind of, kind of spinning. Yeah. And then I kind of, I got home and I was looking into it and I was like, huh, okay. Mm-hmm. And then at the same time, I was super into like entrepreneurship and it kind of went together and it just stuck. And uh, wow. yeah, since junior year. Would you say it's? Because I, I don't know. If, I don't know. If, I don't necessarily uh, say that I don't believe it or that I do. I just, I'm more of like, okay, if I want to get something done, mm-hmm. then you have to have a vision of what the way I yeah, see yeah, it. Yeah, it's like, I'm going to, that's how I'm going to, I'm going to do step A, B, and C yeah, yeah. in order for me to achieve that goal, right? Yeah. yeah. So I don't know, would you, would you attribute your, like uh, any success to manifestation or just attribute it to like what you actually do? Like the behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, yeah. You know? No, for sure, you have to put in the work. But the way I see it, what manifestation is, is um, a reminder. So a reminder yeah. of your goals. Yeah. Like you got to remind yourself, this is what I'm working for. This is what I'm doing. Yeah. So you always have that drive and it's not something you forget. So it's always, I, I see it as a, as a, um, as a hamster wheel. You got to keep your head spinning because mm-hmm. okay. in that way, uh, if people know you're working for shit, if you're putting that energy out there that you're just always looking for shit, mm-hmm. um, you can just be going throughout your day and you'll just pick up an idea mm-hmm. just because your brain is always looking for it. Mm-hmm. So if you remind yourself that you're always looking for it, you can just be walking around and someone says one word or two words and be like, oh, shit, I have a good idea from what he just said. And if you weren't thinking about it before, you just kind of just fucking yeah. plays yeah. over it. So the way you you uh, approach manifestation, is it like written or do you just say it? Uh, Say it. Just say it? Yeah, yeah. But not too much. It's more like uh, like meditation. It's more of just a reminder of the shit I want. I'm like, okay, I want this. I want this. I want that. How do I get that? And then I just go backwards from there. So you're not like on the magic part of it, right? Where it's like oh. people are like, what you put out in the universe uh-huh. comes, the universe comes back and gives it to you. The oh. only magic shit that I, I do is like sex, yeah, manifest- pussy, yeah. huh? <laughs> sex yeah. manifestation. And then like, a, um, I forgot the name, but it's almost like visualization mm-hmm. where um, I do this shit a lot actually, where like I close my eyes mm-hmm. and then I just start imagining shit around my, my room. Yeah. So let's say if I'm laying in my bed. I look Becky G. You know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nah, that, could be some, it, yeah. that could be something like you lay down and be like, now you're kind of imagining your future room. Yeah. So you're like, okay, if I walk forward, I go to the left. I got my big ass TV. If I look to the right, I got a sick ass view. Mm-hmm. If I look forward, I got Becky G bending over. Like Oof. shit like that. <laughs> yeah. you know? So like, you, I'm starting to like this idea. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't know if you guys ever like got it. <laughs> so in your like, in your like 
mind where you start getting chills and you start feeling shit yeah. or even when you listen to music and they're like talking about like getting money yeah. like you feel that mm. so if you can feel that that means that it's attainable yeah so, i don't know if i've ever felt that essentially nah you know what i've done though i've done know. the whole like um imagining like crowds and stuff yeah no that's, that's a huge thing i used to do that all the time that's one of the things the cool a cool one is like i used to listen to like um live performances like mm. like kendrick Lamar, kendrick lamar like when he was doing a you know, mad city in front of like a live audience i'll be outside and i'll listen to it and then i'll put myself as i'm him and then you hear the audience because it's a live performance yeah. so you're closing your eyes and you really feel you're in there which is yeah. wild so that's one thing I do recommend is listen to live music with headphones. Make sure no one's home because you're gonna look weird as fuck. Yeah. And then you just I'll be doing that shit at the bus stop and <laughs> yeah. shit. And yeah. you just go concert. Let me take you down and trip down memory lane. <laughs> yeah, mine was more so WWE entrance, like what I'm Yeah, dead ass. But yeah, that, that's why I was good with the song picking, because I was like, Yeah. The fireworks would hit right they here. They think I'm yeah. cute. The strobe light would hit they right know here. I'm sexy. sexy. I yeah. got the moves. But yeah, 100%. Just live music is insane. Yeah. So, so I, are you saying that you believe in the manifestation? Do you believe in the karma too? And karma yeah do you, do you think like like if you like put out you think it'll like yeah well i like what i like to say is that i don't like to attract karma so i'm like okay. I'm, I'm i'm reversing it because i know karma is a real thing but also if i believe in manifestation i can just manifest not the karma to come to me yeah so mm. true and then if i do something happens in karma i'm like okay it was part of something else so i'm about to manifest i fucking believe in karma. Bitch, I, don't, I don't believe in that shit I, you don't believe in it you don't believe in karma you don't believe in karma Fuck. that's good don't don't believe in it Fuck Dude, that, no. that, that shit's about to get you hard bro <laughs> no bro i heard you was talking shit <laughs> do you know who i am hey, i've been though, fucked my Beto, whole life Beto, Beto, it's been hitting them right that's, why, that's what yeah. i'm saying bro you, my life been good now Fuck. exactly that because you I my dog i'm telling you straight up yeah maybe you live in karma I, you might be bro i you you could try not to believe believe in it. It literally life will just hit you in a certain yeah. way, so, and it'll make you believe. I, in I that think shit. so. You believe in karma, but not manifestation. No, I didn't say I didn't necessarily oh, okay, okay. believe in manifestation. I just don't practice. So it. you a gotcha, bitch? Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? What saying? <laughs> but, I, I, I think manifestation is like such a real thing, bro. Like for real. Like um, there's moments in my life where like sometimes I'm fucking up, right? Where I'm like, I know I'm not where I'm supposed to be. Like mm. I'm either getting way or I'm not trying my hardest or whatever it is. And I just like once I really start to analyze myself, yeah. and I try I start to imagine like just recently, literally at work the other day, I fucking drew on, my, on a random ass piece of paper at work. I drew my future. I drew fucking a million nice. subscribers on my YouTube. Yeah. I drew fucking Bam. stock. I drew stocks because I'm into stocks. So yeah. I drew my stock soaring. <laughs> it's like Nike. <laughs> nah. And, <laughs> and I drew fucking uh, a vending machine just because I, I wanted to draw like, like short term, mid term and long term. Yeah. yeah. You know? So I, I drew the vending machine for short term. And then the uh, the fucking stocks for midterm and YouTube for long term, right? Yeah. And uh, that shit has that shit has worked for me in the past, where it's like I'm fucking mm. up, and it is what he said, right? Where it's like, yeah. uh, you start putting it in your head. Once you start manifesting, manifestation is where like you wake up every day and you're like, okay, let me manifest this shit, and you put it in your head. So now you go every single day, it crosses your mind. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So now you every day you're thinking about it, and now you're connecting shit. Whether I think manifestation works in the way like um whether it's real or not it works because you think you put you put it in your head and every thought that crosses your mind connects to it. Mm -hmm. So now mm -hmm. it's in your head and you make it work whether it's you or whether so it's So it helps you see the picture. Yeah. Yeah. I feel yeah. like a lot of it has to do That's with just not working for you. I feel like a lot of it has <laughs> Crazy. to do with like discipline though. I yeah. I think another good example of what you said that would be cool that you guys might be able to get it uh, with like for example you guys been doing the podcast for a long time mm. so now when you're walking around and you're talking to people and people say something you're like oh shit that's a good podcast topic uh, so yeah. shit like that so that means that you've like it's in your head like the gears are spinning it's, it's always yeah. yeah and it's always looking for a podcast topic yeah. so if you have a gear in your head always looking for whatever you want yeah. it's gonna come like you're now mm -hmm. now you kind of open shit to it like for example um have you ever seen those like not those walls like the where's waldo shit but like it's like national geographic can you spot the leopard mm. yeah and then yeah, at yeah. first you just see a picture and you you don't fucking see a leopard but yeah, then you yeah, read the caption camera. and it's like oh can you spot a leopard now your brain's looking for it and so you're gonna find the leopard i just go to the comments bro they'd be like it's bottom <laughs> left and i'm like there it is <laughs> <laughs> gotcha <laughs> gotcha bitch yeah <laughs> no i mean that yeah, no, I, I not necessarily. I don't necessarily believe that like, it's not real, right? I just think like for me, it's always been like uh, more implemented into, for like from my dad down, like he passed it down to me. It's just like no, the way you get things is by working hard. Yeah, yeah, for and sure. And by working harder than everybody else, mm -hmm. right? So that's just my mindset at, yeah. at all times. It's like I'm not gonna fucking uh, pray to the manifestation gods. Like yeah, I'm gonna yeah. get this shit myself. That's the way I see it. Yeah, but. Maybe I should start manifesting. Yeah, no, a good way. A good way is just like this is one thing I, I was taught is like, what's the downside? So, what would be the downside of you, like 
manifesting. There's no downside. So now yeah. imagine if you have the work ethic and then you're like, okay, let me see if this manifestation shit works. Yeah. So now you're doing both because this shit, this part's not going to negative impact you. So just do it and see what happens. And then you're like, oh shit, you might get more. Mm. That's just, true. What's the mm. easiest way to manifest then? Just think about it. Um, a just, bit, a just a nut and a bitch, and because I no, feel like honestly, you naturally do that. No, like I naturally be like, all right, these are my goals, and like I remind. You know what? You know what's a real fucking good way of reminding yourself uh, your goals is just the situation that you're in. Go talk to your parents. You know what I'm saying? Like when you fucking. <laughs> Oh yeah, when, you're, when your parents are my yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 talk shit on you. Yeah. When, you don't, yeah. when you don't have a door handle in your car, yeah. you're like, yeah. he's supposed to be a dog. Fuck, no, I gotta, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, I, I think with like just with stuff like that, right? Where I feel like you know, I, I feel like all of us are pretty similar. Obviously, I just miss Hosa. So I would mm. I don't want to include him, but talking, to, knowing all of you guys, I feel like we're all pretty similar. Where we don't really think about our problems. I don't think about my fucking problems. You know, like it's just kind of like my problems. That's just part of my life. So it's just that's one thing. Because also, what is that gonna do? That's my girl's problem. I don't think about it, right? So, <laughs> yeah. so I don't think about it. So I just go out throughout my day knowing I have those problems, but I don't think about them. Yeah. So and if they come, you'll be able to. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. Com uh, with uh, compared to manifestation, you're thinking about it. Like you're like, oh shit, let you. Take a time of part of your day to be like, all right, let me think about this. I feel like and that's I, a natural thing that people do, though, is I think that's what we attribute. I think we should attribute it more to nature. Like the fact that there's an eventuality that you're going to eventually have to visualize yourself doing something to get something done. Mm -hmm. You know, and I don't I believe in, in, in a sense of manifestation. I think sometimes maybe people concentrate too much on the big picture. You should be trying to manifest like building blocks yeah. to get to the bigger picture. That's true. The manifestation guys are always like, "Damn, these fools want they all yeah. want a million dollars. <laughs> they all want a Rari, yeah. bro." Fuck. Also, another like the easiest thing to start like your life into success. It's crazy. Buy a big ass whiteboard because once you declutter your mind and you put shit mm -hmm. like if you written writing shit down, even if you think, "Oh, I'm so organized in my head, I won't forget." Just put it. Just put all your. Just declutter your mind on a whiteboard. So now you have more space to think about other shit. Mm -hmm. And then you put that whiteboard near your end, like near your door. So you're always like, okay. I'm well, I, got that I shit. paid. I paid Apple for the two terabytes. So they motherfuckers <laughs> better give me my shit. Like, yeah. about, Run me my memory. Talking about like a vision board type shit. Not a vision board, but like just a whiteboard of you. Sh you could include shit you want on that whiteboard, but like all your ideas, all the all, like your to do list, everything. Just declutter your mind and put it somewhere. So now you have more room to like See, that's not thing. be worrying about I, shit. I have, all that's, that shit. I have all that shit. That's the thing is that's that's like a such a great an idea, but people just make it corny, bro. Yeah. That's the problem that I think steers a lot of people away is because yeah. people make it corny and they start putting names to things. Yeah, yeah. And they're like, let me have a vision a board. Vision board and, and it's like, bro, like, no, yeah, just write so it stupid. down. Like, honestly, but, anything can be a, like your phone yeah. wallpaper is a vision board. Yeah. Like, like my if, shit's a Bentley. If you told anybody right now, like, Go. What's in your mind right now? Go write it down. Just go write it down. Everything that's in your mind, all your bills, yeah, yeah. all your all your vision, how you're gonna get to something. Write it down. They'd be like, "Oh, that's a good idea." But motherfuckers start talking about vision board. But how much like, of, how much of that is prior though? Like just because you're calling it a vision board, like who fucking cares? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like how much of that is that you being prideful and be like, "Oh, I'm not." No, fucking, because I'm not gonna fucking it's corny have a vision because board. it's believing that there's like a math to it. I think, like you're trying to make it quant like too quantifiable, like, where it's almost. Like a, a formula, like of of how, like a formula for success. You know, people put it like that. My yeah. thing, I, what I've noticed is like a bunch of successful people believe in manifestation. Mm -hmm. So it's like, okay, if these successful people believe it, let me just let me try it out. Yeah, shout out Hitler. <laughs> you, believe you think he believed in manifestation? Yeah, you know, he, he had a plan. It. He visualized yeah. it. Yeah. 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 Well, he wanted to get a, rid of a bunch. Of <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, committed genocide, but yeah. shout out Hitler for sure. Yeah. Yeah. He's like, now you're right. I get what you're saying, though. I think the it's like what Lalo said, the man cave, right? Like the the thought of a man cave is like corny. Yeah. But the I, you corny the, ass. <laughs> but no, but like actually having like a space yeah. for you to just be a man in, I guess that's yeah. cool. You know what I'm saying? But just yeah. like you're saying, like they branded as some as such. Yeah, that's what makes it corny, something. right? Yeah. right. Like, I want a, room a vision my, board is not corny. Yeah, I want a room to myself where mm -hmm. my boys can come in. Mm -hmm. I want a man cave. man cave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I want a man cave. Yeah. <laughs> it's, like a, it's like a bat cave. That's just sick. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. For sure. What, what do you think is a clear example of where like manifestation has worked out in your life? Oh, uh, what are you uh, doing? The, the New York uh, billboard. So we just got a billboard at Times Square and like literally. That's crazy. Saw that. That's bad. Wow. Wow. That's bad. Congrats. 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 That's, That's sick. sick. So with that one, before the podcast or anything, like I knew I wanted to work in entertainment, but I was like, I don't know if it's going to be acting. I don't know if it's going to be music, but I know it's going to be somewhere there. And I remember I was so in my head. I was like, bro, like I fucking hate the life I'm living right now. Like I got to get out of here. I felt very stuck. 
Mm-hmm. So that week I called my cousin. I was like, yo, bro, let's let's go to New York. I just got to go out there. I just got to see. I got to. That's the thing with visualization. You got to see that it's possible. So I went to New York and we got some hotel. And I remember I was I was in the hotel. I was looking out the window yeah. and then it's a bunch of buildings around you. But I'll see all the way at the top, like penthouses. They'll have all these party lights. Everybody's like having parties. You're like, what the fuck? I want to be up there. And then we went to uh, we went to Times Square and I was like, I want to I, I can see myself on these billboards. Like it's going to happen. I don't know how, but I can see it. So I took a picture of me standing in front of a billboard. I was like, one day I'm going to come back to this picture and I'm going to repost it. And then uh, like two weeks ago, I did just that. That's fucking crazy. And then the the billboard that I took a, a picture in front of was right next to the actual billboard I got. Damn. So, Literally right fucking right, there. Yeah, right there. Damn, bro. You know what? You right, fool. I'm going to start doing this shit. That's yeah, crazy. Bro, you, you, don't, you don't believe in that shit, bro? You better fucking start believing yeah, in that yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get yeah, out of here, bro. Like, right now, I'm visioning it right next to your picture, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah. It's so possible but now. But it's just like, me, not these fools. Just me. <laughs> That's crazy because my mom did that one time. One time she took a picture and it was me and my brother and we were in front of Boomers and she's like, one day, right? And literally that same day, bro, she got kicked out of Boomers, dog. And I was like, bro, that's manifestation right there. You manifested that. <laughs> she did yeah. that shit. She really but whatever, it. man. I You get nah. your free yeah, personal I think, pizza. Yeah, and w- once you put yourself in that position, you, you're like, oh, shit, this is cool. Like, have you ever been like at a, like, if you ever get like a sick ass Airbnb or you go to or like a friend's house who's got a sick ass house and you walk in and you're like, damn. And you're just thinking to yourself, damn, one day I want this. <laughs> damn. You know? Your bitch is bum. <laughs> 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 you manifest yourself with his bitch. Yeah. <laughs> his girl was the one Yo. that was making the whole money, yeah. so she just broke up with him. Yeah, yeah. Bro. yeah just get yourself. No, in you're those, right. Yeah, get yourself there just so you can feel it. I think that's especially like fucking um, noticeable for me when you see somebody that looks like you, mm-hmm. maybe talks like you, or maybe has like the same upbringing as you. Do something like that. You're like, oh, it's possible. You know, that's yeah, why it's yeah. important for like people like you um and ourselves to like succeed and shit so that way we can show the fucking that the, the youth that you can do this yeah, type yeah. of shit you know the, the nobodies i'm just kidding crazy the, the peasants the did, yeah did, did you feel that type of way i'm oh, sorry no 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 yeah go ahead I, did you feel that type of way when you got to work with uh, ego for the first time bro i was so fucking nervous first time i met ego insane i've never been this nervous ever i feel like we all grew up with him right yeah we all grew up with him right yeah, yeah. Fuck and, yeah. yeah. Ego? did you johnny watch you Ego? yeah i did yeah oh, Total Adventures Okay But, yeah, but uh, I grew up Like watching Like the Total Adventures All that like mm-hmm. To the core I knew like all the characters mm-hmm. So um, we had um, uh, a Pablo on the show And he was the first one We had on the show And then I told him I was like yo bro Like can you like Put in a good word For like Super Ego Tell him we said what's up And he's like yeah bro Don't worry I got you I got you And he made it happen mm-hmm. And uh, I swear to th- Like we were fucking nervous I've never been so nervous For a guest Like we've had like to this day big guest but no one's gotten me nerve as nervous as super ego yeah because yeah he was such like you said he's such like someone you look up to yeah. and someone who looks like you someone talks like you so when you see someone do it you're like holy shit and then now you don't want like you want to meet him you want to be yourself but also you want to respect them and you want to like show give him his flowers but also yeah you, you don't want to become off too like yeah too much like, like a fanboy yeah, almost, yeah yeah so you're just everything you're just so in your head but uh that was the most nerve-wracking one because he's one of the like, persons that look like you you know growing yeah up yeah that. Was making noise in the space that you're working in now. Yeah. So like, I can only manage to like work with him. It's just yeah. like, oh shit! Like it's like a kind of like about like. Yeah. You know, it, it just it might feel some type of way, like in a good way. Nah, if you fuck, if you guys fuck with him, I can hit him up. And be like, yo, pull up, cause he's he's IE now. It's a little secret. Oh, he's, he's IE now. Damn. Don't, don't tell the fans. <laughs> that was my neighbor, and I haven't said shit. Like, this whole time. I just came back and I walked from his house. Yeah, yeah. Bro, now, now that you bring it up, you think you could put in a good word for us? <laughs> nah, yeah, I could. Yeah. Now nah, we're super close. Like, nah, bro, I, I want a billboard, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I put a billboard with yeah, yeah. Spotify. I'll let you guys know. Yeah, let's, Spotify. Let's, nah, let's bro, Spotify. Let's Spotify. Yeah. We'll, we'll tone it down. We'll, we'll say all the. That's the thing, bro. <laughs> that's the. That's what we had to do. Because when we started the podcast, we were wild. I think what switched for us is uh, we got a really big like deal with Disney. And, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it, it was going to be a huge thing. Like, this shit was going to be like a bag, and it was going to be like, we're going like to a premieres and all this shit. Mm-hmm. And they're like, okay, no, yeah, we're solid. The only thing we're going to do is we're just going to review your channel because it is Disney. Uh, <laughs> Damn. Uh, <laughs> Dropped all that shit. They, yeah. they, they let us go. Hey, Dreams, I think you got to chill from now on. <laughs> See, not, that's, that's why I tell you, like, you guys should do, do the Patreon. Mm-hmm. That way you can have that because then you have a second source of income and you can be yourself but when it comes to 
getting to these brands and opportunities, they review your channel. They know the shit you say. Yeah. And I'm you, only half myself on this fucking podcast. <laughs> you imagine if I get my full yeah. self on here? Yeah. Don't say that. Yeah. Wait, cut that shit out, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro. Nah, because you'd be surprised. You, you'd be surprised. Like, I'd be fucking around, like, saying shit about Becky G, but I'm pretty sure, like, Becky G maybe has seen it because you'd be so surprised. I I've, I found out like big people who who've seen our episode were like, "What the fuck?" Yeah. You wouldn't think it's possible. Dude. Where like people are like, but if you're on TikTok, yeah, and your view, if you get views on TikTok, that shit gets pushed to everyone, everyone. Yeah. Mm-hmm. everyone. So let's say you guys have a funny ass clip. This is what we were fucking up a lot. Shout out Barack. <laughs> we were. Uh, <laughs> I remember I was doing a lot of like Mexican history stuff. So and that shit was going viral and people were fucking with it and like, oh, I want to see more. And then they go see the full episode and they're like, what the fuck? It was, it was not historic yeah. at all. It was, it was, like, not, it yeah. was historically yeah. about what happened mm. last night. Yeah. Every time we're talking about strip clubs and shit. Mm-hmm. So, uh, yeah, we definitely, we've thought about it too before because we even, we've had the conversation, right? It's like, all right, do we, do we play it clean? Yeah. Do, uh, like, obviously, because we, we know, like, all, like we were saying earlier, like, all our shit gets demonetized immediately, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah. Like, it doesn't even, like, there's <laughs> no point in trying to be like. That's why you got to buy the merch. There's yeah. no point in being, like, inappropriate language. It's like, nah, bro, this is, like, gonna... the worst of the worst type of yeah. shit, you know? Fucking Dreams has started episodes saying he's going to get, he's but, not molested by this dude <laughs> girl, bro. What's in the, the forest? No, Theo, no, Theo, no. <laughs> yeah. and, and you, know, but, you know what's funny? It's uh, when we went to Arizona, we had our Uber driver, right? And he had his fucking YouTube channel on. It was a Tesla. Oh, yeah, so he had yeah, a, yeah. And he has a TV in the back on the Tesla and it has his YouTube channel. And I was like, oh, yo, is this your YouTube channel? He's like, yeah, bro, subscribe, right? And we're like, oh, yeah, subscribe to our, to our podcast and to our YouTube channels, right? He subscribed. He's like, oh, shit, you guys are big, you know? And he's like, and we're like, yeah, you know what? It's 10K. It's not too crazy. And then he's like, nah, bro. Like, you guys must be making money for real. (laughs) And we're like, nah, bro. Like, we say some out of pocket shit. What? He's like, like nah, what? I don't Cl- Clicks on the first one, it's it's fucking dreams. Yeah, I got molested by a fucking <laughs> guy named Harold. Yeah, it's Gerald. Yeah. All right, but then also like, there's listeners that they need that. You know, they want to yeah. they want to be yeah. with their homies they like fucking around. So really. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah. It's like this entire, like for the since the beginning of this podcast yeah. when uh, Lalo and Dream started it's like it's been this yeah, yeah. so me. would you dilute the fucking product like we've said it nah. like, would you dilute the product for I guess the gain for monetary uh, gain mm-hmm. or do you just stay yourself and hopefully in the future it works out and I think I'll ultimately switch up. I got bills bro I'll switch up right now <laughs> we start making Christian shit yeah. once you start getting yeah <laughs> Jesus <laughs> but what you what you I want in that. my mouth Jesus. No, no, now what you could do is you know you build this core audience here but you you make another channel you make other stuff mm-hmm. where that one you could be a little bit more brand friendly so yeah. you kind of already have a head start in the whole like you can just bring people over but I also look at fucking dudes like like Tom Segura right yeah, yeah. their shit's not clean at all bro yeah. and, and, I, and you look at a lot of like big comedians who've done their mm-hmm. who've gotten successful on their podcast and like yeah they it's essentially I mean, eventually people do start working with them because yeah, it's yeah. like there's there's too many views there anyways to begin with. So why yeah. it'd be stupid for us to not even work with them, you know? No, exactly, hundred percent. You can get those types of brands. Like for example, Manscaped, they're fucking sick. Yeah, they don't give yeah. a yeah, fuck. Yeah, they don't give a fuck. I remember when when Lalo first reached out, or when, when they reached out to Lalo, we had a press. Him. Lalo was like, "Hey, just so you guys know, like we we say crazy shit." Yeah, and yeah. He was like, "Yeah, that's what we love." Yeah, they all love right. that shit. Yeah, I'm like fuck yeah, let's do it. Yeah, Manscaped, Blue Chew, all those like those like cool little brands yeah. and uh not how they fuck with it but for, like the disney people they don't fuck with it yeah <laughs> fuck those yeah. Yeah. Mom, i'm not trying to be coco fool. I'm, just to, <laughs> I'm just an actor at the disneyland with the with the coco shit on yeah they work with larry the cable guy so it's, it, it's not you know it's yeah. possible yeah, yeah. and you know yeah. It, it they got him out of there yeah but they actually also just targeted him for the role yeah damn uh, if you're big enough no one can ignore you so yeah it, well it was not uh, be so good they can't ignore you. So that's, that, right. that's another. We're gonna fight those sexual man. allegations, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we got you guys. You didn't do it, bro. I didn't. I do believe it. you, bro. Yeah, I didn't yeah. touch you. Oh, all right, let's get to what the people are here are here for. All right. Uh, what, what? All right, welcome back to exposing Johnny. Uh oh. Hey, well, let's tell us uh, what it is. Yeah, what's oh. exposing? All right, exposing Johnny. So, um, it's a new segment. It's a new segment that I started. Where I expose Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's okay. It. <laughs> but tell him what are the most some of the reasons in the past where you exposed Johnny for? All right. Just recently, I had the worst one the where, border where one? I told I told everybody mm, that yeah, no problem. The border one. <laughs> where I told everybody. Hopefully, that's the worst one. So essentially, bro, like. Johnny is our homie. We love this motherfucker to death. But he does some questionable stuff. And whenever you let him take charge, 
Uh-huh. Just know some shit's gonna go wrong, right? Uh-huh. Like, let's yeah. say you ever hang out with Johnny for whatever reason. We're right? gonna like, hang out not too long. Yeah, yeah. 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 So just just know some shit's gonna go down. <laughs> we're supposed to go to Tecate. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Oh, we're supposed to go get off Malo and shit. Yeah. But yeah, that's 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 pretty much what it is. Like, Johnny always gives us stories to talk about. Yeah, that's sick. So All right, so so on this episode of exposing Johnny, so I wanted to make my girlfriend a spooky mask, right? And Damn, um, pussy. Same. We got one too. <laughs> that was a sim. Yeah, so that was a sim. Oh, I, was trying, I was trying to hit tonight. <laughs> <laughs> all of us? Yeah, yeah, we're yeah. all bent over. Oh, yeah, you can try. <laughs> Manifest it. Uh, <laughs> I might have it. Uh, yeah, so um, so my girl's been wanting the biggies, uh, the Buzzball biggies, the Halloween one. I don't mm, know if you guys have seen yeah. it. Yeah. The, like the pumpkin one. So we went to Total and wa- Total Wine and More, and we couldn't find them. We asked, and they're like, oh, yeah, we ran out. Like, there's no more. Damn. We went to Bevmo, no more. So we went with Johnny, and Johnny's like, oh, I looked it up, right? And they they were in stock in San Diego. So we were considering, like, fuck, should we go to San Diego? Like, Johnny's like, bro, let's go to San Diego. Like, we'll make a whole vlog out of it. Yeah. And we're thinking about it. We're like, ah, nah, it's too much, bro. Like, let's not do it, right? Yeah. But a couple of days later, Johnny found it right here in Fontana. Mm-hmm. And he calls me. He's like, hey, bro, I found the, I found it. I bought one and he posted it, right? Yeah. I was like, oh shit, that's fucking badass. You think you'll buy me one? He's like, yeah, but I got you. So he go, went to go buy it. Like right away. Yeah, like right away. He went to go buy for, it. For like reference, how big is that shit? Because I've only it's seen big. the post. It's in the fridge. Shit, yeah, it's yeah. pumpkin. It's like dead ass? No. Smaller, it's smaller. It's a little smaller. It's not that much smaller. You've seen the biggies, right? The biggies. But I've seen the biggies, but I've never seen the same size. I'm seeing size. Oh, what? Okay. It's, it's not like that then. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's just smaller. customized, Halloween customized. Yeah. So um, so he got it for me and I was like, fuck yeah, thank you, bro. I'm going to put it, I'm going to make a spooky basket for her and I'm going to put in her spooky basket. Mm-hmm. So yesterday, um, oh, I wanted to make a vlog out of it too, right? So I told Johnny, hey, you think you could come record me like buying her shit for the spooky basket? He's like, yeah, I got you, bro. I was like, all right, bring the buzz ball. Right? This was yesterday in the morning. Yeah. yeah. I was like, bring the buzz ball. He's like, yeah, bro, of course. I got you. I got you. Right? So whatever. And that, uh, later on, he came like at 9.30 at night. At Not night. like at 8.30 at night. At night. Yeah. So, and he comes and we go to the store and we're and I'm like, he's recording me buy shit for my girl and everything. And I go, all right, cool, bro. Like, it's, like especially with the buzz ball, that shit's going to look badass, right? Yeah. And he's like, oh, bro, I didn't bring the buzz ball. I was like, bro, what? <laughs> uh, he's like, dude, I forgot. Bro, I forgot the buzz ball. This like, dude's dude. like... I told you to bring it at fucking 9 a.m., bro. Tell me before I head out. Don't tell me 15 you, hours before. No, my man. But I told you. But that's not the The reason you're going. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, this yeah. In my head, I'm like, oh, we're doing spooky basket. I'm going to go film for it. In your head, shit don't work out for that's why you. Need, that's, that's why you need a thinking. whiteboard. Yeah. yeah. All your thoughts on a whiteboard. No, yeah, so that, that was Johnny's excuse. like, bro, you told me in the morning, bro. I was yeah. like, bro, I don't give a fuck if I told you in the morning. <laughs> oh, that's shit. Hey, I fucking told you to bring the buzz. Whose spooky basket is it? Mine or yours? I told you. Remember, dog. I told you to bring the. I told you the buzz ball was for the fucking spooky Spooky basket. Yeah. Mm. So and you, literally the reason you came was to record for me and for the fucking buzz ball, bro. And you the forgot basket. the buzz ball. He's like, bro, you didn't. T- you told me in the morning. You should have told me again. I was like, bro, you should have brought yeah. it. Period. How was my responsibility? Is your shit? Is your video? You tell me. I, I, I have there, to be on top of your no shit. Way that you think you're right in this situation. Yeah, I am. <laughs> and, but and you then, got him the buzz ball. And then yeah. Yeah, like that, so I was telling him this right. We're on. Our, we're at the store. I was like, bro. I told you in the morning. He's like, bro, you sound like a girl right now. <laughs> He's gaslighting you. He's gaslighting you. He's gaslighting you. Gas gas yeah. I, like, yeah. like, I feel like there is never a biggie buzz ball. I feel like oh, it was never now, there. Now we're getting to the oh, fucking... It's a conspiracy. Yeah, I don't that, think it was ever there. Uh, Where's the fucking buzz ball, Johnny? He says it's in the fridge. It's in the but, fridge now, yeah. yeah. yeah you got yeah, it this morning. It's just a regular I, pumpkin. No, I sent him a picture of it. I sent him yeah, everything. He, I got it. I that's why it. he's sleeping. He's been up all morning looking for that shit. Nah, yeah, but... No. So I was like, bro, like, I told you in the morning. I shouldn't have to tell you again, you yeah, know? Yeah, like, you the whole reason was for you to come. Awesome. And he's like, bro, you sound like a fucking girl right now, bro. He's like, my mom. He's like, you sound like a girl. You should have told me before I came, not in the fucking morning. I was like, bro, you should have fucking brought it. That's the fucking story. Talk to his ass. No, yeah, he's right. He's hey, so right. do you have a Johnny in your in your friend group? Oh, honestly, you remind me a lot like Aaron. Damn. Oh, oh he's handsome. Oh. <laughs> he, he's cute as fuck. Yeah. Good looking dude. Hey, yeah. why, why why is he cute as fuck now though? Hey. Uh, oh, yeah, his mindset, it. his mindset changed. We, oh yeah, yeah. We saw that's, him at the the homie's at the wedding. wedding. No? Yeah. yeah, dude looks good, bro. Yeah. Now nah, you know what it took. He had to get his heart broken. He got his heart broken. It always, yeah. That's always what it is. Nah, He's out here getting yeah. bitches now. Nah, same thing with yeah. this. Food. He had his heart broken months ago. Johnny got his heart broken. He just started eating yeah. more. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a different heart nah, broken. He, he was like, he, he told me, I remember the, the, his final words, like the words that turned him into a villain. 
he was like, he was angry. He's like, bro, I'm fucking tired of all these girls telling me the same excuse, telling me the same thing that they just want to be my friend. I'm fucking done. Like I'm, yeah. a, I'm, a I'm work- trying to hit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I'm gonna work out. And I'm gonna say no to all those bitches. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, That's a TikTok clip. There's right like there. lightning in the back. Yeah. Oh. Now I was like, oh shit. He's like getting his PR yeah. and shit. Yeah. yeah. Not, not, not dead ass, bro. Some girl that was, I, I, I got jealous now because some girl that was damning me was damning Aaron too. Damn. And I was like, oh. I was like, I gotta, yeah. I gotta start going to the gym. Yeah, yeah, I got, I got good competition. All of a sudden, now. he starts getting messages. Who are you talking about? Which one is that? Yeah, Damn. crazy. That's fire. But shout out to Aaron. He fucking he's shout like it's four a.m. He pulls up to the gym. Like even though we have a busy ass day, he wakes up at four. He's gonna go to the gym. Yeah, dude, he's motivated as fuck. He's he's got a fire burning in him right now. Sometimes you do need that push, like yeah. that fucking that heartbreak. Yeah, and to just really get you fucking going, bro. Yeah, or. Yeah, just like that super, what do they call it? Like that rock bottom moment yeah, where you're yeah, just yeah. like, because I remember I had that shit once, bro, uh, but it was financially. It wasn't about no bitch. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I fucking, I went to go pump gas, bro, and that shit stopped at like $2. Yeah. And I was like, fuck, yeah. no one day, is way. Like, I, w- I went to Pollo Loco, got a $5, $5 bull, declined. No! <laughs> Been there, done that, bro. Yeah, that that's that shit where you're just like, you're like, I just take a cup of water. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Run that shit again. Yeah. You're like, fuck. You get the cut more. You start cleaning it. You get the client twice. Yeah, and as you guys, man, when I remember when I reached rock bottom, I turn around, I open my eyes, in the morning I saw my bitch. I'm like, oh. <laughs> She's still here. Fuck. It wasn't a dream. It was this morning. <laughs> Rock bottom. <laughs> what did I do? Oh, shit. <laughs> Gave away the best years. Imagine. <laughs> I'm kidding, baby. Damn. Love you. Damn. I love. She's, she's great. Loves, you got to give her props. She's yeah. a trooper. She takes. She, she takes all that shit on the they chain. They know what this is. They know what this is. <laughs> yeah, they know what this is. You want money or not? Yeah, hey, she should though, bro. Because if she didn't take that shit, you'll just find the no- another one. Bro. What the <laughs> yeah, 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 spitting yeah. right now. Eh? Talking what? shit, Beto. You think there's any, you think there's any girl out there that can really? Because like you said earlier, right? You're focusing on your career. Yeah. Do you think there's a girl that could take you? Becky G, Maybe. bro. He said it, bro. He said Becky, it. G. Becky G. Is Becky G only? You think you think there's a girl that you're like, all right, she's worth my time and also like that. Yeah, yeah. Like, now I really, I just recently was, uh, I was dating this girl recently, and she's like in the influencer space. Like she's huge. Like she's you guys are dating, dating or name drop. Nah, that's a thing. Like I don't got a name. <laughs> okay. I was like, I was ready to like be like take her serious and all that stuff. Be loved. Oh. But I was just a hoe to her. Oh, uh-oh. Mm. hey, well, that you're happens. Just, you you're know? just a number to her. Yeah, I was just a number her. Like yeah. she was, uh, she wasn't looking for. She was just looking for like a fuck buddy. Dang. But like we'll go on That's dates. The and worst. She made, but she made that like clear up front. Yeah, no, nah, she told me. She told me. Uh, I remember I. <laughs> You hit her with the what are we? No, no, no. I sent her, I sent her, I fuck, I don't be sending girls like songs, but I sent her a song. Oh. You dedicated a song? Yeah, and it was cute. And she, and then she told me, she sent me a paragraph. She's like, hey, honestly, I want you to, I want to let you know, like, I'm off a relationship right now. Like, I, I just broke, like, I just got off a relationship like, a couple months ago. I'm, I'm not looking fuck. for anything serious. <laughs> Damn. And yeah, she just wants to fuck. That's it. Yeah. I remember the day it felt, the day it felt hard, like, um, uh, like we fucked. And then like, well, I slept, I, I stayed the night and then the, uh, the next morning. Nah, bro, you got it twisted though. She fucked, you made love. Yeah, no, nah, she fucked. <laughs> nah, cause she was like at the, like in the morning, she, I was like, I told her like, I'm a dick. Like this. <laughs> she got her nut and left. <laughs> nah, dead ass. Nah, she told me, she's like, are you, uh, you just, she was like, just remember to lock the door when you, when you leave. Yeah. And then she just knocked out. Fuck. I was like, damn, I feel used right <laughs> yeah. now. Yeah. Like, yeah. Holy shit. shit. She just got dick to sleep? Yeah. I, bro, I felt so used. She said. Yeah. Did you hit the gym right after or what? <sighs> nah. <laughs> but I turned into I turned into a monster. You should have hit up Aaron and hit the gym right after. Bro. Yeah. I turned into a monster. I, I started, because uh, I was off my whole shit. Like, I was like, I'm going to take this girl serious. So, like, for the past couple months, like, I have, I really was not sleeping with anybody else. It was just her. But then she, t- she hit me with that. And then she was like, I know you're fucking other girls, like, or whatever. And I'm Damn. like, no, I really am not. Mm-hmm. And then that was that, that night. And then she was like, um, she was like, when she told me, she was like, yeah, just lock the door and, and just lock the door when you leave. And she fu- and she uh, fell asleep. I'm like, this girl is, does not care about me. I, just, yeah. I was like, damn. Yeah. And then I just, uh, I went on a rampage. It wouldn't hurt so much if like you just got to sleep for a little bit, you know? Yeah. yeah. Like at least if you would have got your like your 15 minutes of sleep real quick and yeah. then you leave. <laughs> but wham, bam, and then you go, all right, you got to go. Like, She's Bitch. like, she here's a towel. Yeah, yeah. go wipe yourself off. <laughs> yeah. 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 I was yeah. like, damn. But that, that was one girl I was 
that that was my reason. I feel like the yeah, roles yeah. were the roles were reversed. Nah, yeah. Yeah. Every time you say that shit, yeah. you fuck. I know. The roles were reversed. The roles were reversed. Yeah, that was my karma. That was my karma. The revolves and the first. Yeah. Because yeah. I had a follow up question because I listened to a lot of the podcasts that you were on. Like uh, everywhere, it was just going like everybody. Yo, you, sick. You've been hoeing. Like, oh, <laughs> yeah. been hopping on. But a lot of it has to do with like you. You keep saying that you have a character that you play on. Yeah, the podcast, yeah, yeah. Right. I was like, okay, where does that line? Blur when it comes to girls. Yeah. Or is that if it's personal, just keep. No, no, I'll, I'll go for it. But you know, it's obviously like I'm like okay, because yeah. everything you say is online, right? Like it's it's, it's all out there, whatever. Mm -hmm. And it's like, oh, if I'm saying this because it's a character, it's like, all yeah. right. What if you want to take a girl serious? Like, do you, those jokes don't come up anymore? Or like, is there like a line? I did. I did this rec recently. I was kind of chilling out with that shit. Yeah. Because I knew like it affects, and I really, I was really taking this girl serious. So I was like, let me kind of chill out with those types of jokes. But um, that line where I just say like, because as an entertainer, like as you you guys know, like we fucking we record for a long ass time, yeah. so you got to keep that shit, you got to keep that fire going. Yeah. So you're always trying to like, you always got to add more fucking salsa. So you're always yeah, adding yeah, shit, yeah. you're always adding more crazy shit. So like it does affect because then girls like clip it and be like, hey, what was this that you said? And I'm like, oh no, mm. I was just kidding. I called then, you a bitch. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> but then like when you have a platform and then like you see girls like you as a girl, like if you look, if you like some influencer and you see a bunch of girls in their comments then you know like he's got options he's got hoes how are you not fucking this girl like this girl's hot mm -hmm. so they're like super in their head and then especially with the shit i say they're even more in their head mm -hmm. so i really show i really give them no reason to believe me and that's mm -hmm. what fucks me over being yeah. honest with yourself right now mm -hmm. oh. i'm not saying you're lying or anything like that yeah. i'm just saying being honest <laughs> do you think you're like you'd be a great boyfriend to somebody that you wanted to be with oh for sure for, for sure, sure. I, what, even what like, do you think separates you from like 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 oh like this I'm, is some shit that you wouldn't get unless yeah, it's yeah. like me, you know. I'm I'm pretty like I'm I'm very thoughtful. Like I think yeah. about them first. I, I think about like, thoughts a lot too. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm thoughtful, dog. Yeah, damn, you got, you're full of thoughts. Full of thoughts. Crazy. No, like I have a bunch of homegirls that tell me like, because they they know me. They're like, yeah, so you'll be a good boyfriend. I was like, well, fucking mm -hmm. be my girlfriend. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I want somebody just I'm like you. I'm tired of being your yeah. friend. <laughs> somebody just like want, you. I, you. You would great. Someone just say exactly, but nah. But um, yeah. as of right now, I'm like, you know what? All I'm, I, all I care about is <clears throat> business, and I'm gonna make shit happen. And um, the girl's gonna come and go, and it's the life I chose at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I feel like when the time comes where you are ready for a girl, I think it's gonna have to be someone that's like minded. Yeah. Like yeah. you can't have a girl that's just there. Like if she's she's gotta be busy like you. Yeah, I, feel, I feel like that's what you really need. Yeah. Somebody that's business minded and all that shit. You think she'll be in industry? That's, that's, that's that girl I was just talking to was exact. That girl, she's from fucking Miami right now. Like she flies like oh. like three times a month. That's, like, that's, that's the first. Thing. That's the first red flag. That, that, that is a red flag. Miami, oh. and Miami. That's why she went. Nah, Miami. she told me a lot of. Yeah. What's wrong with Miami, bro? Yeah, I am well, Miami. They Finn, looking for the hoochie daddies. Up. Yeah, I don't think I could date a girl like that. There's a, like, uh, I'm there's a really like good a, football team most, there, Mostly because I got a girlfriend but yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What kind of bitches are you looking at right now? <laughs> a Low short, key? curly no, hair I'm saying though, if I was on your short list The right exact now. opposite <laughs> oh. no, I'll t Well I'll tell you like My my girl is a fucking uh, Like she's a complete opposite of me right She doesn't like this fucking camera bullshit yeah, yeah, She doesn't yeah. like to be in front of like the limelight or whatever. Like we do, we create <laughs> that limelight. Shit, all right, we're like, <laughs> you, need, you need a girl <laughs> like, like that. You need a like. Let's be real. Yeah, like yeah, all yeah. of us here, we are fucking attention whores, bro. Oh, we're no. so we're so funny. Like watch us, yeah, fucking. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like no, my girl be trying to get in the spotlight. <laughs> <laughs> you got a dumper, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck out my spotlight. Hey, but like yeah. that's why I need her and shit to balance you. balance Humble myself you, out, bro. She's like a fucking. Yeah. It's funny, like. The conversations that I have with her are so different from the conversations. That's good. They're that boring. Huh? So weird yeah, way to say boring. They're weird way to say boring. Weird way to say boring. But nah, yeah. I've been saying no, that. But like, it's I need like, to study a studious she, girl. She, it's funny. Like, Not because these fools keep asking us when you're going to put your girls on the episode. Ain't nobody want them boring ass bitches <laughs> on this fucking episode, bro. Last, last week, we had the our grandparents' anniversary, right? Yeah. And like when I talked to Gazelle, we're like fucking, you know, like it's all fucking jokes and shit. Yeah. And then so is my, me and my girl and then him and his girl sitting yeah. on the same table. They were just like, yeah, and then like, oh, uh, you know, Leonardo DiCaprio of, oh, not DiCaprio, not fucking, <laughs> fuck, the, the Ninja Leonardo, Turtle, Leonardo Da Vinci, this and that. And yeah, I was like, yeah, what the we fuck? talking about philosophy. I was like, this is my cousin. This is not the same cousin that I have uh, on the fucking podcast. Got low key, the, the last thing she told me, I was talking to her. It was good night. This is dead as a, <laughs> the last conversation, like the last meaningful conversation we had. She was talking about how like. She wants to make an impact on the youth of fucking. Oh, uh, brother. Okay, Jenny Smith. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, like. No, I'm so, being like, two, so dead ass. Two like, she. Podcast ago, yeah. we made fun of Gazelle for saying Fathom. But when I sat across, <laughs> when we sat across from, when I sat across from him at, the, at our family party, 
he was him and his girl were using words like fathom yeah. philanthropist yeah. yeah and i was like oh okay that's why he used cilantro <laughs> that's crazy, <laughs> crazy as well but i've always been yeah. into that bro like i've always <laughs> even from like high school and shit i've always been into like the nerdy girls and the girls who, hot. the mm-hmm. smartest fuck i i, I want to date somebody who's They're smarter boring. than me right you want a girl who brings like knowledge and something to the table like something yeah. like, no. a different perspective cooking yeah uh, stuff like that makes like my girl's like into us. politics and shit i'm just like fuck so i don't, fuck give, no. I don't a give a one. fuck about <laughs> that shit yeah no nah, but it's not to the point where you know like uh i don't know yeah yeah too liberal or anything like that so you're on the lane of like um we'll understand each other's problems like the, the girl that you want to date in the future yeah like, you, gonna be. like she's She's gonna be busy. She's gonna be working with people. I'm gonna be working with people. Yeah. yeah. And it's like a, there's like a mutual understanding. Like my yeah. time's over here, your time's over there. But and then we just you'd say up. you could date an industry girl though. That's fucking. That's That'll probably he, be like my next has, girl. He has to because a bunch it's of tough. they understand it. That's the thing. They understand what you're doing, but now you gotta understand them. They, that's gotta, the thing. You gotta, they, and some this food. is about me. Fuck, yeah. It's not about you. Oh, that shit. Nah, yeah. when I tell you. And in my mind, you're a whore. Like, <laughs> well, but bro, like let's get real. If he's like, hey, I'm gonna go to Miami for three days for a show. Any other girl, any other girls gonna be like you're gonna be with bitches, yeah, yeah, accuse yeah. you. I you're you're never home. Well, he is, but, but yeah. if the girl's not home either, bro, like yeah. But what about when she's like, I'm gonna go to Miami in three days. That's not the same. Bro. You're gonna him, be with him, bitches. Him going to Miami for three days and her going to Miami. For no, three we're days going to Miami for three days. Shit, yeah, th- yeah, three. Di- not nah, de- nah, the Actually, people was she was with, thing. the people she was around, the story she'll the story she'll tell me about her friends, what they do. Yeah. And I'm like, uh, like those are your friends. You hang out with them. Thoughts of a feather. Verge of a. But oh, what? athlete. Hey, athletes and rappers at first, at first you were like i'm trying to wife her <laughs> yeah and then you hear some shit i'm like oh, fuck. Uh, that's crazy <sighs> Dwayne wade really <laughs> kobe bryant kevin what? durant he's what? Yeah. Dick is huge. i'm not even lying i'm not even lying about kobe bryant yeah. i can't even put a fucking <laughs> den in that yeah that's disgusting yeah. old deep dish pussy over here <laughs> yeah but so what what uh what? <laughs> anyway why, why did this take forever to happen bro what happened or what <sighs> It's been a minute, dog. Uh, I had to like. This uh, supposed to happen a long time ago, man. Yeah, a long time ago. It was just uh, oh, shit. <laughs> a bunch. Of, yeah, it was a bunch of just like figuring shit out, processing shit. I'm pretty sure you want to get into like the whole Michelle thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, shout out to yeah. homegirl. I'm pretty sure everyone's here for that shit. Yeah, hey, is that the title? Hey, what's no, the name? no, no, no. What's no, no. the name of this episode? So we'll spill the tea. Damn. Is, she, is Michelle coming out? Give, of me, give me a crying face, bro. Yeah. yeah. Nah. Nah, <laughs> put, put, put the sad right. music. Nah, but for those who don't know, right? So so we'll. She's backstage. Imagine she's here right now. <laughs> Saul is the is the producer and the owner of uh, IE and Bestie. IE and Bestie's <laughs> and and uh, for those, I'm pretty sure a lot of you know, but you know what's up. Uh, Michelle was previously a host on that show, right? They had a falling out. Immediately after they had a falling out, we had Michelle on the show. Mm-hmm. We tried to, I mean, even, even before we even fucking um, recorded the show, we all had a conversation like, "Look, bro, we're gonna be as neutral as we can. We're not here to fucking." burn bridges Smart, with anybody yeah. you know what i'm saying like yeah, yeah. and i feel like that translated well like, even when you watch the episode back it wasn't like oh, what the fuck there you know it wasn't like that right at least that wasn't our intention if it yeah, came yeah, off yeah. like that to you then um our apologies yeah, our apologies for sure, for sure. Yeah. uh i i always stress that shit out right and then as time went on it was a lot of like oh okay well i think the driving factor right mm. right was i would have never noticed but lalo lalo does drive um is more on top of shit like that. Where he was like, oh shit, bro. They, that fool follow, unfollowed us on mm-hmm. Instagram. And I was like, oh shit. Then it must have been fucking personal, right? Like yeah. it must have been like a dagger to the fucking. Which I get, right? Like roles reversed. <laughs> <laughs> Role reversed. I yeah. guess if, if that would have happened to us, maybe you do feel some type of way. And yeah, yeah. you always try to come from a place of understanding. And it was never like any bad blood in between us. But yeah, yeah. it was definitely like, oh shit. Is there something fucking going wrong? On. What's going on? But you don't. you also don't want to be like assuming shit you don't want to assume yeah, no, shit, exactly, you know what i'm saying yeah. so, so i don't know from your perspective how did you see it yeah i'll tell you the whole thing and also um i'm great i'm grateful that you guys <laughs> bring, brought me on because even when I, I i made that call i was like fuck i hope like because at the end of the day none of this shit matters and i'm like i'm really i'm really like hurt that because we can build something huge like you guys are killing it we're killing it i'm like damn i really i really let a girl get in this get away get in the way of this so basically what happened was um the whole thing michelle like she came for my head like insane like this girl would go on lives and and this is what i think i i know michelle are cool now right yeah we're cool now to preface that yeah yeah we're cool now yeah we're cool always someone's be like see they ain't cool and it's like yeah no that's not true i think that's why it took a while because i did also have to like me and michelle like had to get cool and we had to get understanding 
So I was like, I had to just get through all that stuff first. You guys had a closet to clean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So what happened was, so I took, I decided to take all the shots on besties because I was like, I know Michelle works in social media. I don't want to damage her reputation. That's the last thing I want to do. And then I, I don't want to damage the girl's reputation on besties. So I'm going to take the hits because like, I'm a producer, I'm a creator. If something fucks up here, I'll make something else. No worries. Yeah. So um, I made sure, I, I told, I noticed like, Really, what happened was uh, nothing that was outside. It was a conflict between the girls, like the girls that were not getting along. I, there was an ultimatum where they told me, they're like, yo, if she's still on here, we don't want to do this podcast anymore. And I'm like, fuck. So I'm putting in a tough, I'm being put in a tough position. I'm like, yeah. okay, do I lose two or do I lose one? Because the show was super successful. It was doing really, really good. Yeah, and it's still doing really yeah. well to this day. It was, uh, yeah, it was It's doing, it's cool. But um, so that was it. And I've known Michelle for a minute. And I was like, yo, Michelle, like, I fuck with you. You're talented. You got some shit going on. It's just not working out here. All right. It's not working out here. And me as a producer, as a creator, mind you, we're like 14 episodes in. So the sooner you do it, the better, because I don't want to be wasting her time. I'm like, I want to keep you around. We can do more shit. Trust me. I'm, I'm going to be doing more shit and I've done more shit. But um, she didn't accept it. She, she took that shit to the heart. I mean, it's okay. I get it. It's I understand it. Being like doing something very good and then getting cut off. Yeah, who wants to get booted? Nobody wants. Yeah, to no one wants to get booted. Yeah. But I made her know, like, yo, I want to keep working with you. Mm -hmm. And um, but nah, she didn't take that shit lightly. So I kind of said, I kind of took the hit. I told her it was my decision. It was mm -hmm. everything I wanted to do. But uh, at the end of the day, it was the girls. But I was trying to protect the the show. Mm -hmm. Then I wanted to protect Michelle by not. I didn't want to like fucking throw shit to her. Yeah. Because uh. The yeah. reason why the girls didn't get along was because a lot of things mm -hmm. Michelle would do, which was weird, mm -hmm. which anybody would be like, yo, what the fuck? Like, it, it was, I don't want to get too much into it, but you know, yeah, 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 but, you know, you know, yeah you know. but the girls didn't, they, they just couldn't get along with her. Well, I just think it was probably just like an age gap thing. Nah, I wasn't, th it wasn't that. It's, it's okay. a lot of personalities. Yeah, it, it's like clashing too. And then you got to remember too, like uh, without thrashing anybody, cause I'm not, a, I don't really, I really don't want, mm -hmm. I'm not interested in doing that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I thought the, uh, um, there was just a disconnect because you did assemble the girls randomly, yeah, right? Yeah, they so didn't like, know each they other. They didn't know each other, right? Yeah. So so that comes with its impl like uh, yeah. complications, you know? For sure, yeah. Cause and you were kind of like, all right, because I saw what you did, bro. Like, it was smart as fuck, right? Um, like I said, I, I'm, I was an avid listener mm -hmm. of the show. And I remember when you had Steph on and I was like, this girl fucking can talk her Yeah, yeah, She's yeah. She's fucking yeah. good at, when you guys had her on Friends. Yeah. I was like, this girl is cool as fuck. And then... um. Michelle, obviously, you also mm -hmm. you 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 said like you said you knew her through yeah, through different media, stuff, yeah. and yeah, bro. When you assembled, I was like, doubt, bro. This shit's gonna go crazy. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, like you don't know what's gonna happen because there's just three different personalities, and you're just throwing them on in front of camera. It's right. like work. Like, yeah, they never met. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know never met. Let's let's do work. So obviously, something's not gonna fit on yeah. your first shot. So I noticed it. I noticed. Uh, I did notice the girls were a little bit more overpowering than her. She wouldn't be getting that much. And then she came from a place where she was a star in her own world, where she was like, she was like the main person. So it was different for her to kind of share it. So then, mm. kind of like just shits just started like flaring out. Like, oh, what the fuck? You cut me off. It was stuff like that where it's just like it's it's weird because. Like, if you guys cut each other off, you don't think of it, mm -hmm. right? Because you guys know each other. You guys are homies. Mm -hmm. But if a random person just cuts you off a lot, it's just like, the fuck, dog? Like, let me, let me talk. Yeah. So it just started, like, shit that wasn't a big thing. It just snowballed into more and more and more. Yeah. And then so the girls just started having, like, a little few things. So I was like, all right, I'm just going to, I'm a, because I. You know what's know funny? Someone, it's, it's, yeah. it's very, it's it's not like something that's not relatable, though. It's like it's like when you bring your girl, like, right? You have a girl. And then you, you she. Delusion meets doom. she meets your homies girl and they're like oh, and they're yeah. and then your girl's like when you're in the car later there she's like i don't really fuck with her and, and it's, like, it's that and it's just that. like bro like, happens yeah. every time yeah, it's, huh? it's happens up, every you know? time it happens yeah. every time and it's shit that's it's just that like situation yeah though. it's just like what the fuck it's shit that they start like they plant a seed and then something little will happen and that seed will keep growing and then they just start not liking each other for little so like, what you did was the right thing was just like all right let's just put an end to this yeah. here before blows up into something exactly else. before it blows up into something big and i was like all right it's 14 episodes in we're still early on the show like fans there's no way i can get this shit right yeah fans aren't attached to anybody yeah no, yeah there's no one attached so yeah. that's what i wanted that's to do thing, that's what you thought when though. you think about <laughs> it too, that's were, what i thought they were attached. Yeah. They were super attached 14 yeah. that's 14 weeks yeah. that's what i was gonna say like yeah. in, that sh in the, the big picture it's only 14 episodes but also 
over the course of time yeah 14 weeks is a long time yeah to like for things to like to happen like, for yeah, a lot yeah. of shit to happen in between exactly because you're going in there every week yeah. so so when i when i tell you like i treaded so carefully because i was like i fuck with michelle i fuck with the girls i don't want to lose any of these relationships it took me about a week to kind of come up to like to kind of figure out like how am i going to approach this and i finally told her and she took it really really bad like in, insanely bad and i was like damn so she started like going on a bunch of lives right she was doing all these lives and she was like trashing my name like and and it was okay like i took that i was like as long as she's not trashing besties because she didn't really trash besties it was all me he's like oh he's so unprofessional it was but all those of you that had said you yeah, yeah yeah so it was all me so she was telling a bunch of lives people were sending me screenshots big you big creators because when you're on live everybody sees that shit yeah big creators were sending me this shit like yo bro did you see what she said and then i was like what the fuck so she's going in on my head right well, fans are not helping either yeah, yeah yeah and then um yeah the fans are just trash well, they're there for it bro <laughs> that's what i'm saying yeah they're, they're like, like yeah <laughs> yeah no yeah they're they're like going at they're going at me like insane like i had to i was like damn i had to step away from all of this shit. i was like damn my bad like I, I was really trying to make the best out of i, I didn't want to like damage her reputation mm -hmm. but she gives no fucks about damaging my reputation like she was trying to end that shit mm -hmm. and then so i was like damn for sure and then it came on um i don't even know how this happened but someone told me like yo i saw like ponte las pilas was like commenting on her tick on her live saying like hey come like like say it on our on our podcast or whatever yeah and then they told me that's like yo what the fuck like why and mind you also this was at the heat of everything when i was getting attacked literally every day mm -hmm. uh dms and then people were even messaging uh stephanie's husband like crazy shit every everybody involved was just getting yeah. hit every bullet and i was like damn what the fuck and then um so when she hopped on that show well on your i'm sorry on your show um it just created like it created a, more, a bigger thing mm -hmm. and i was like damn what the fuck because mind you like cause I, I, we've met like i remember i meeting you guys at a bar before the, the riverside yeah riverside and i was like oh fuck yeah i finally meet these guys these are, these are sick so i mean also i guess it was kind of in my way i don't want to say it was like like hey, we, bro, speak like, your truth, bro. It's all yeah. good. No, no, like, ain't nobody not, gonna, ain't nobody gonna yeah. get mad here. Nah, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't even here yet. <laughs> no, yeah, so. no I, it's definitely yeah. like, I can see why you'd be like, damn, yeah. like, that's fucking fake. Yeah, because for me, that's like, fake as fuck. Yeah, like, my homies, like, if it was like my homies, are fake, bro. Yeah. My, my homies wouldn't do that. They wouldn't bring uh, someone <laughs> who's like trashing my name on their platform. Yeah, so I was ready just seeing you guys as my homies. Mm, so yeah. when you guys did that, I was like, yo, what the fuck? These guys are fake. But then also, that's my fault because I didn't really know you guys. Yeah. We we're just like in the same scene. So I understand it. And I was like, damn. So it kind of it hit me. I was like, damn, what the fuck? I thought we we're all, we we're cool. I, you know, that's crazy and of you guys, bro. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, you were dirty as And it's like, this is the, like, this is the thing that like really got me. I was like it was at the end of the day it was all antics like she will go on these rants on live and like on shit and then at the end of the day she will screenshot her numbers post it on her close friends and be like oh my god guys look how many views it got and i was like yo this is all fake i was like all this shit she's talking is so fake and then so it just hit me it just hit me with that i was like man what the fuck is all this it's just like it's all at the end of the day it's just like fucking clout mm -hmm. and i'm like damn whatever so i just kind of just got away from that space i was like okay whatever and then recently I bumped into her, which was fucking random. And uh, this is where it really hit me where everything is all fake. I remember I went, I was on a date. I went on a, I went to a bar. I was on a date. Miami girl? No, not Miami girl. Damn, so I Damn. Miami girl. Yeah, she yeah. Got a, she's the one that got away. Nah, fuck her, bro. <laughs> Miami girl's actually gonna be the one that texts me after this. Damn, shout out Miami. <laughs> but uh, I went to a date, I, I was on a date, we went to a bar. And as I'm walking through the crowd, I feel someone like tap my shoulder. And mind you, this is probably like two, three months after like everything. And then I look back and it's it's Michelle. You haven't spoken since? No, we haven't spoken since. This is the first time I see her since mm -hmm. everything. I, t I get tapped on the shoulder and she's like, oh my God, Saul, how are you been? I missed you. Mm -hmm. She's giving me a tight hug and everything. And I'm, in my head, I'm like, what the fuck? Even her friends mm -hmm. like step back and look so confused. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? And then I was like, oh, yeah, it was, it's good seeing you. And, like, I walked back. And the girl was with She knew everything. She's like, was that her? And I was like, yeah. I was like, I'm so fucking confused. But I just let that shit go. And then I saw her again at, a, at, a, at the same bar. And then it was just the same thing. She was, like, cool. And then third time, I was like, oh, okay. Okay, I think we're, we're cool. We're good. Because mm -hmm. I never saw, like, I never decided, like, I was never attacking her ever. I was like, she, I always had love for her. I always respected her. So I always just thought that she hated me. So when she started showing love to me, I was like, oh, okay, what the fuck's going on? Mm -hmm. So she started showing love. 
And I was like, okay, cool. We're, I guess we're cool. We're homies. We're treading carefully. And then I realized like, yo, this, all this shit was all fucking fake. And then I lost like this, like friendship. And I'm like, damn, this fucking sucks. Yeah, because it was building. That's why I emphasize yeah. it was supposed to happen a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. It, no, it was building. Because we reached, you had reached out, what, probably like two years ago? Yeah. Yeah. When we were like. Yeah, no, nah, we were, we're going to make we're, that shit happen. And like yeah. I said, for like dead ass, like. Remember, I remember when I told you at the bar too. I was like, I was being, so, I was being so yeah, dead yeah. serious, bro. I was like, "Hey, bro, congrats on everything." Like, yeah, I remember, yeah. I, I was like, no, yeah. "You guys are fucking killing it," because you guys are, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, everything I said was tr was like, like genuine, you know. And uh, that's the thing that you feel like you don't really run into in this mm -hmm. space, yeah, yeah. Because you always feel like people might be fucking meat riding and yeah, shit, yeah, 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 or like yeah. they're trying to get something out of you. But it's like, no. At least for me, is it was it was genuine. It's coming from a place of fucking like admiration you know yeah, yeah. because this shit we know what it is to fucking come in here week in week out yeah, yeah. and and crank out these episodes and at times you don't want to fucking do it and then not even that to then also reach a level of success mm -hmm. it's like yeah bro props my boy like yeah. that's it i like at no point that night was i like hey bro when are you gonna have me on yeah yeah, yeah. never dog it was just like good shit fool you're doing yeah, yeah. you're doing your thing right so then when all this shit went down i was like oh fuck uh this kind of sucks yeah um but also, I also understood Lalo, right? Because essentially, it was a, a decision from Lalo. It was like, oh, there's some fucking, there's a topic right now that needs to be addressed. Mm -hmm. He's seeing it through his eyes, right? Like through his producer eyes yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. It's like, how do we remain neutral? How do we remain uh, not being assholes, but also at the same time, driving eyes yeah, yeah, to yeah. our product that we're fucking, no, as you, you know should. what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. So, and I know you understand that also yeah, as a yeah, producer yeah. where it's like, but maybe that's also like a learning experience for us where it's mm -hmm. like, okay, maybe there's some things that you just, yeah you should probably steer away from because you don't, you really don't want to burn bridges with anybody. Because yeah. at the end of the day, like I've said this shit time and time again, we've had like a lot of conversations here where it's like, bro, any success that IE and friends have that Bueno Bueno have, mm -hmm. that Bessies have will ultimately end up helping us 100%. no matter what. 100%. I'm, I'm literally for IE. You know like when saying? people talk shit, I'm I'm back in IE every time. And uh um, Regard, regardless, yeah, yeah. but I'm saying like everybody like bro, yeah. anybody, right? Yeah. Even if Duno is fucking doing which he is, he's yeah, doing yeah. crazy. It's like that's a representation of us in, in some way, yeah, yeah, shape, yeah. Or, yeah. or manner, right? So if that fool succeeds, guess what? It's like who's like minded, who also represents this um space. This that market. Space. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. It's like it always gonna ultimately help us. So uh, you never want to really, unless somebody's just blatantly going like, man, fuck those yeah, yeah, yeah. And you really don't want to burn no bridges. I think yeah. what it is at the end of the day is just, um, another reason why it took me so long too, because I'm, I, me and Michelle, we like, we squashed our shit long ass time ago. Is just, uh, what I've been learning is like just processing your emotions so you don't speak out of your ass and say shit you regret. So that was the thing with like Michelle, you guys caught her at a time when she was hot, where she was fucking, she had a lot of yeah. things to say. Mm -hmm. So um, I was like, damn, okay, cool. Let her, me personally, I would have waited like probably a little bit more weeks till she kind of chilled out. But um, no, that happened. That kept the ball rolling because it was kind of already dying out. Then she hopped on the podcast and then it, it went back up. And I was like, man, what the fuck? I yeah. thought we were done with this. So it, it was mostly that. And then for me, I was like, I did have like some like, some like, I don't know what's the right word, but I was like, I was like hurt. I was like, man. Resentment? Yeah, I, I think, I don't know what that word means, but probably. <laughs> <laughs> but I was like, man, man, these guys like, they like, they helped her come after me. So I was like, I don't want, I don't want to talk to them right now. Like whatever. And then, but then like just processing yourself, processing your emotions, processing your decisions. Cause I put myself in your shoes. I talked to my friends. They're like, yeah, you got to see the, like the, at the end of the day, we're all trying to make it out. It's the business side. And I'm like, yeah, I get it. Yeah, I feel, I feel it. It's not like they came. I knew you guys didn't come in bad intentions at all. I knew you guys didn't do it. But it was just like me, like fucking had a de dealing with my own emotions, dealing with the girl's emotions, dealing with Michelle's emotions, dealing with the fucking hundreds of comments I was getting every day. So I had to deal with all that shit. And I was just taking, I was taking all, I was taking everything in. So it took me a while to finally be like, all right, cool. I'm done with, I'm, I'm done with all of this. I want to make amends with you guys. I called yeah. you over and we did that shit. But uh, I do, I'm I'm grateful because I always knew. I even told, uh, I, I've talk, I talked to Rex a lot from Bueno Bueno. Oh. I told him, I was like, if I'm ever going to, because everybody's always been waiting from from my side of the Michelle story. Mm. I was like, if I'm if I if I'm ever gonna say it, it's gonna be on Ponte Las Pilas. Mm. Like that's that's what's gonna happen. Like I don't want to nah, do fuck it. Fuck that. No, <laughs> like, Dude, I, I was like, lie. yeah, I didn't want to do it on I am Friends. I was like, I want to go do it on Ponte Las Pilas. That's where I want to do it. But I'm gonna do it when I'm ready. 
So I feel like enough growth, enough time has passed, enough. Um, I've met a lot of people who've came and gone and I'm just like, none of this shit matters. It's all fake. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm super for helping each other. So when I was catching myself in a position where I was like, nah, I don't want to hop on the show. I was like, the fuck for what? Yeah. I was like, damn, I'm being a hypocrite to myself right now. Mm. So I was like, I want to I wanna really think about everything I've done, think about things they've done, see things from their perspectives. Hopefully they see shit from my perspective. And when I'm ready, I'll, I'll hop on. So, yeah, yeah. And I think it's a, it's a good time now. I think it was a true test of time. You're right, though, mm. because um, I think early on, too, uh, maybe you could have interpreted it as like ah, you know they might not even be doing this shit like in a year from now you know but i think as time progressed you were oh, like yeah. oh shit they're still doing it and that's like and, the, and they were like actually yeah like they're they're actually about this shit because we, sure. we are in here week in and week out and you always respect people like that a hundred percent that's actually saying? a great point because i've had people like like I, I had I have people come up to me all the time saying, yo, bro, like I'm really trying to do this. Like, trust me, like just just put me on or whatever, whatever. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm gonna give you a time. And then they just disappear. They stop pursuing it. Exactly. Yeah. But no, nah, I you guys been doing this shit for longer than I have. Like you guys really been fucking put it in. So yeah. I respect you. your guys' work ethic hundred yeah. percent. No, we really them, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we really fucking them, bro. I don't, don't want to take ass. no credit. Yeah. I yeah. Was, these nah, people's. I take that fucking credit, nah, bro. Take it. I did this shit. And you know what? Get the fuck out of my chair. Get the fuck out of my chair. And fuck Brian Bethel, dog. I built all this shit. And fuck Maple Alley. The cameras in your mind, bro. I remember. I remember seeing your guys' podcast. Like it when it was just like a, it was a couch and it was like a black drape like yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it was like you guys were doing it for we a long struggling. time yeah bro it all, it, all, it all started it all started when you know I had a we had a YouTube channel called Torta Squad and <laughs> shut the fuck up Beto <laughs> we <laughs> um, I know yeah yeah. yeah I mean bro. And I, but yeah, the consistency. all that aside though um, we're happy to have you guys we're happy to have you here and we're trying to meet the rest um, of your, your yeah. team yeah, too oh no yeah we're gonna make it happen November oh. 1st yeah, cause uh -oh. imagine yeah, like all this. November first is a teaser. We're going over there. Yeah, when we yeah, think yeah. about like the stuff that you have done and the stuff that we have done, if you just, put it, I, it's barely fathomable, yeah, bro. Fuck you. To even just just put together what we both could do in this space yeah. for everyone around us, yeah. because but I we're because we're all mingling within that space, yeah. like within other like podcasts, like shout out La Familia, shout yeah, out Toast yeah. Alive, shout out all them, and it's like just think about the potential of what that could be. It's it speaks to. You know, we won't be looking like, I don't want to say small fries. We were never small fries, but mm -hmm. we'll be taking a little bit more serious. 100%. Yeah. yeah. It's a, it's a conversation now. Yeah. It's a whole thing now. We're going like, to do drive-bys every day in LA. Yeah. Yeah. Not that. <laughs> it's like now LA podcasts are talking about IE podcasts. Yeah. It's a whole thing. Yeah, you all wish true. you were us. Yeah, they stay crazy. <laughs> they, they, stay talk, they stay talking about you out there, yeah. but you know, it is what it is. Yeah. 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 Uh, I hope, yeah. I hope that that message does translate though. It's like mm -hmm. it, at, at no point was the intention of like this you yeah or nothing, you know yeah what I'm it's, it's not like good. i can see how you <laughs> for sure yeah. um bro we're not stupid like yeah. yeah i think i think had that happened to us you feel the same type of way bro yeah, yeah. you know what i'm saying it, because you do have that and also that like ego and shit the also one thing that it's it's also like a product of our environment because we grew we grew up out here right where if people are looking at you funny like it's beef if yeah. people are like yeah. talking shit it's beef if people are hanging out with the, with your ops, it's beef. Bro, for you used yeah. to fight fools, and you didn't even know if they were really talking shit about you. Exactly. Yeah. They're just like, hey, fuck, yeah. I heard that one fool was like, for real? And then you go get down, and you didn't yeah. even know if it was real. And that's yeah. just, and it's not even nobody's fault. It's just how we grew up. So that was still kind of instilled in me. It's like, oh, they fucking with the ops. They my op. So that's, it's just like, and it's just a product of the environment we unfortunately grew up in. So once we start realizing shit, because uh, even one of my co-hosts, he tells me like people will be looking at him and he gets all mad. I'm like, bro, these are fans now. <laughs> all right, they're fans. They're staring at you because yeah. they recognize oh, you. Yeah. Don't get mad. I'm trying to fuck yeah. him. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. it is also it had to do with the 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 environment. Like, nah, she they fucking with the ops. They my op shit like that. Mm -hmm. But now like you grow up, you mature, you you fucking really like look look shit deeper than what it really is and everything's yeah. okay yeah. it's not as deep at the end of the day do you think um that that drama helped you guys out too get more exposure because people no. love people love because <laughs> people love drama right and like people that like maybe have never heard of like i am friends or michelle no. but they're like oh shit what the fuck is going on over here like tuned in to i am friends and tuned in to michelle so you don't think that helped you guys out not at all <laughs> that we can't say the same thing but it ha yeah so no, uh, our most viewed like, video <laughs> not like besties besties they were averaging like twenty thousand views like fuck. like like when michelle was on and then she like trashed our name and um all those fans 
that like really respected me, respected everything I've built, they've all left me because of lies. Damn. And it's really, it hurt us. Like it, it fucking, it hurt the bag ultimately. I was like, we we're making really good money. She spread a lot of lies, really damaged my name. Mm -hmm. At one point she said she was gonna sue me. It was, it was a crazy shit. And uh, we lost a lot of loyal fans and people came to me like disappointed in me. And they're like, I can't believe you're like this. Like I thought you were better than this. And I was like, if only you knew I'm protecting her image because I know this is what she wants to do and I'm protecting the girl's image. You don't know that, but yeah. I was like, you'll find out one day. I was like, one day it'll come to light. But um, for me, I'm super on the, um, I'm like, it's, all, it's always good always shows at the end. Mm -hmm. So I was like, I don't care how long it's going to take. Uh, one day people are going to understand what I, what I did. Mm -hmm. And it, it was never from a bad place. I can yeah. never do that. Yeah. And hopefully that this helps in that sense, you know? Yeah. Because people are going to, because some people are obviously, that gave us a big jump. And I'll never shy away from saying that. That, that mm -hmm. episode gave us a huge fucking yeah, yeah. jump. And like, well, I don't think it was people that stuck around, though. <laughs> no, there was, no, there was a lot <laughs> they of people. The, maybe well, some people did. Yeah, yeah, some people yeah. stuck around. <laughs> obviously, some, obviously, I'm not saying all fucking yeah, yeah. 45,000 people. But you gained fucking, some. You yeah. gained some. So it's just you know, cool. so it's yeah. like, I know yeah. some people uh, that stayed and they were saying like, you know, came from the beef over there, but fuck the ops now. Where I'm gonna hang out with y'all here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. y'all bringing up Michelle actually. Yeah. So it's like, hopefully, since I know a lot of them still listen, because they still share, and I know who they, who yeah. came from over there. Uh -huh. Hey, hey like, bro, fuck these fools. I'm gonna start some beef with these fools. I'm gonna hop on your part, bro. Oh yeah, yeah hop on. <laughs> the Johnny. But uh, hopefully, they, the Johnny they, story. They, they, yeah. they, you know, bother listening. You know, like. No, yeah, I hope. That's know. why I was like, I gotta come out here. I gotta, I gotta do yeah. it on Ponte Las Pilas yeah. for sure. So, and honestly, I like I fuck with you guys heavy. Like you guys uh, have an insanely really good name insanely yeah. marketable name and i'm like yo if you guys you guys can really make some shit happen just by the name alone your guys's merch was fucking insane thanks for that was really good you. that was some really good merch thank you so um that shit, that shit, we didn't even sell 10 shirts bro yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that shit's hard but that's because all y'all just views bro <laughs> <laughs> you know your fucking place we bro. fake the numbers yeah. Yeah. not trust fiverr ads hit crazy i was fucking even uh not ponte las pilas is like it's such like a like a, a thing that people say that no one even like made it into a brand and you guys made it into a brand yeah. so now you got to capitalize on it and you could thank me bro i'm the one who came up with all that <laughs> that shit was hard, yeah. that shit was hard. Yeah. He's, he's amazing. thank you bro it all started with one youtube video where we your hands are <laughs> yeah your hands are uh, soft bro uh, no, i don't, I don't be, right now i don't you know all i do is type bro i'm sorry <laughs> You're, you're hyping us up, bro. I appreciate it. And and likewise, man, the the respect is there yeah. uh, towards you guys because you guys are obviously, bro, you guys are you guys are at a different tier. You guys have been doing, you guys have mm -hmm. been killing it. And um, Honestly, you yeah, guys that's can, sick, bro. Yeah. That fucking, that New York shit is dope yeah. as fuck, bro. You, got, you, can, you, you always, can do it, but you just got to stop with the, like, the tranny mm -hmm. jokes. And, and, uh, <laughs> nah. Right. It was cool. Hey, you better be happy it was with cool a, thinking we'd be up there. You better be happy <laughs> with a billboard in the 210, bro. <laughs> Hell At yeah. most. No, but it's like naturally, right? Like in this space, right? Of course, you always see maybe somebody who's doing better than you. And then you mm -hmm. feel, you feel that inkling of jealousy, mm -hmm. right? Whereas like now, like, bro, I mean, uh, for me, yeah, it yeah was bro, never, I was it was hating, never really bro. Like, <laughs> I had you on my vision board. No, <laughs> but it's like, with the target, you, yeah. you feel that inkling of jealousy, but like yeah. now, like, bro, like meeting you, uh -huh. we've been chopping it up. You're cool as fuck. You're literally another one of the boys. And it's like, Oh, now it's not jealousy. It's like mm. fuck yeah, that was killing it, and yeah. and your team's killing it, and yeah. and that's just like motivation for us too. You know what I'm saying? Like motivation. Um, I think I think uh, that it reminds me of a lot of um, how La Platica and um, brown and bag. Brown Bag how they they really gave each other the respect once yeah, they yeah. linked up together, mm -hmm. where it was like, uh, yeah, it was like this is not competition. This is like if anything that you do is just gonna help us. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 No comment there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got my own thing. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Nah. Yeah. Not La Platica. Shout out La Platica. Oh, they fuck with you guys, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Nah. They're they're they're, cool. they're our sponsors too. They're 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 amazing. They're hey, cool. bro. Earlier you were talking about Super Ego and like helping us out. Now you're talking about La Platica helping us out. Just let them know what's up. <laughs> 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 Nah, they're just all on Brian Beckham on this channel. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, and I'm not talking about Ponte Las Pilas. I'm talking about my YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> your personal. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, bro. Uh, you, you're gonna see him on, on like La Platica <laughs> as a guest. Uh, hey, imagine Brian and Beto collapsed yeah. with La Platica before yeah. Ponte Las Pilas. Uh, fuck you, Beto. <laughs> <laughs> Pack up hey, your hey, shit. Hey, we, wish you, we wish you all the success. We wish nah, you all the success. And it's really cool meeting uh, genuine podcasters because there's other podcasters that they just be talking, mm. but when it comes down to it, 
they not they not with the they not with the for the people. Facts. Drop some names right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna look for some clues. Yeah, 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 You're yeah. a piece of shit, bro. Nah, look, <laughs> look, as soon as it's just over, bro, I need you to get out of here. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> like we got our clips, everything's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, bro. Imagine yeah. we start recording, like we all go our separate ways. Yeah, nobody talks yeah, to yeah, yeah, bro, you can call me Miami because as soon as we're out of here, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna show you the door. You give him a towel. Just tell me the towel. Hey, bro, what the fuck? It's a used towel too. Is there anything that Anybody has to say? Get yeah, off our test? spooky stories on the Tuesday. No, no, we're not doing that. How long uh, have we, we good if you want? But no, we've been going on for a minute, huh? Oh yeah, just to emphasize what he was saying earlier. Like, what time do we start recording? Two o'clock or one o'clock? Two o'clock, right? Like well, it was like one thirty. We got here, so we got here at one, and we've been here for like four hours already. Yeah. So Hang like, on for real. We've been, we've been recording for like two hours. It's probably gonna get crunched down to what an hour twenty. Another two hours to go. Come on, let's do it. Nah, I and, and that's wow. just hard. That's the hard work that we're talking about. We just be coming here putting hard work. Yeah, just having fun, and that's how you know, like. How time goes by really fast if you just just, you're just having fun. My girl don't understand though. <laughs> <laughs> but we just had a couple of modelos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She yeah. don't understand how hard I work. You get home just fucking stinking like this. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. She's like, with the barrel. Yeah, you don't know how, how hard I work for this shit. <laughs> now, Gazelle has said it before on the podcast where he says like we're creating this ecosystem where like you know like where I got my YouTube channel we got the Beto, podcast. shut up, bro. We, there's, there's ecosystem. There's, there's, that shit's very important. And then there's Maple Alley, and then aside from that, there's like. Like the other podcasts, like mm -hmm. I am friends, you know, bueno bueno, yeah. Kick or just crew, like everybody. yeah, exactly, everybody. a bunch of other podcasts where it is this ecosystem and it's a badass ecosystem. Be, uh, whether we've met them or we haven't met them, it's like it's such a cool thing. It's like it's a good feeling to have, you know. Like yeah. this are this is my first time meeting you, you mm -hmm. know, and it it is a good feeling knowing like there's other people like. I know other people might come at me in the comments because people have come at me in like on my lives before like bro you just joined Ponte Las Pilas like yeah, who do you yeah. think you are you know but it's like his voice are shaky <laughs> fuck you <laughs> nah, but it, yeah, it, it yeah. is it's a like a super badass feeling to have where it's like other people are oh. doing the same thing and it's like it's a really cool feeling and you know you just feel like this is my first time meeting you but I already have something in common with you and mm -hmm. like it's it's whether it's even though it's my first time meeting you it doesn't feel like it's my first time meeting yeah, you yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying so it is like a really good feeling no for sure bro I appreciate the 100% and that's one thing I want to like emphasize that we all out here uh, there's already so many people against us so like why are we going against each other Fuck my and for example like on like on my podcast um, you know like when you go on the analytics who else are your subscribers watching it's Ponte Las Pilas and then who else are your subscribers watching? It's La Familia. It's <laughs> you know Kickback Crew. Hey, bro, it doesn't say Brianna and Beth are on there. It doesn't say. It doesn't. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Hey, you know what's funny? For when, when, when the so called beef was going on, right? Because it was never really emphasized. Like, for, they would be like, when are you guys going to go on? I ain't even friends. We just skip past the comment. <laughs> Not that, yeah. that same. People would be like, when are you getting on Ponte Las Pilas? Yeah. Yeah. Like, anyway. <laughs> but, <laughs> we didn't read it. No, Johnny, Johnny did get a new haircut. Right? <laughs> yeah. And then there'd be time with the live, the live chat slowed down. It's just yeah. that comment there. You're just like, yeah. Get on. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. Did you skip it? Hey, someone asked you a question. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're, you're, you're not going to answer up, this. You start yeah. making up. You ever, uh, ever kind of just mutter a little bit the part of it? It was like oh, it was when I friend. read it on uh, accident. Yeah. yeah. And but with it, me, like I always answer them. I'll be like soon. But it was yeah, funny because right, when you know when the Spotify rap came out, yeah. it was just both of our names. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, like we're there. We're yeah. there. Yeah. You got to share it. Show sure you like. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It was never. No, nah, I guess it was just like very. Yeah. It, it came with time. It just takes yeah. like. Oh yeah. Talk, well, let's just talking say man all, to man and shit. Let's just say we're all happy that it's over with. It's yeah. like, no, I'm trying to start a new beef, bro. That's what I'm yeah. saying. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Yo, Actually, I had Aaron, an idea. I had an idea. Uh, yeah, it's to like have IE podcast, beef with LA podcast. Let's do it. I'm let's down. Do it. But in gang shootouts. Yeah, start like an S a East Coast, West Coast type shit. Yeah. Like, but like shuffle wait, battle? Wait, wait, wait. Tupac got killed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, <laughs> someone's got to take a bullet. How, how, about we never, how about we never air this podcast? Because like this so called beef you guys are talking about, it was never out there in public, you know? So we never fucking monetize that beef. You know what I'm saying? So this tracks. Yeah. Hey, next week, I hey, fuck them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go off. Yeah, we actually just scrap this episode. Yeah. yeah. And then we're going to talk shit on ours. And then you guys talk shit. Let's yeah. do it. And, and maybe start, a four in LA. Yeah. And yeah. then we start fake beef. And then after like six months, you release this episode. I'm be like, Aaron isn't yeah. really skinny. He's wearing a bodysuit. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it's a speakeasy yeah. skin. It's green screen, bro. Yeah, that's not yeah. even Aaron. No, he got cloned. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he got <Yeah>. closed. <laughs> hey, people are gonna clip that shit too much. Yeah. Damn. I do. I be doing like random Illuminati shit just so when I get what famous. The fuck. Mm -hmm. When I get famous, people are like make a montage of me. <laughs> random. This is that how you pussy. <laughs> random. Yeah. Just randomly, just yeah. like yeah, yeah, yeah. every picture ever. He's just like you have like a six 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 tat right here. Yeah, yeah. It's an upside down cross. Yeah. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. All right. I'm gonna start manifesting, bro. All right. Manifesting. Cool. I'm glad we. 
Yeah. We talked about it. We talked yeah. about it. Yeah. Facts. Communication. Uh, yeah. And then with that being said, <laughs> <You I>, said <laughs> uh, we really killed that shit, King. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, I think we're going to end this episode. Let's go watch the KSI fight. Who, yeah. who won? Who won? I don't know. No, you don't. Know, um, but but why did we have you here? Bro? Yeah. I'll look it up right now. But uh, thank you to Saul. Thank you to IE and friends yeah. and besties and bueno, everybody bueno. else. Bueno. Uh, shout out to IE podcasts that are out there right now. You shout know who we're talking IE about. IE movies. Shout yeah. out. Yeah. I am movies died. I, I, I am foodie. Like, I, I'm, I'm mentioning all of them. <laughs> all, yeah. all the RIPs, R- all the IEP R- R- podcasts. R- Damn, bro, you're a dick. You cut I in movies. That's my favorite one. No kids for Michelle's right now. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she was spinning. Right? She, she was spinning. She, she, she spinning some facts. Yeah, but shout out all these IE podcasts. Damn, shout Tom. out my girl. She's always taking these fucking jokes on the chin, just like these fists. She's not, bro. <laughs> um, T- Tommy she Fury. Is, Tommy though. Fury won. She is though. Did us? Yeah. Tommy no. Fury by decision. Hell yeah. Let's go. Oh, Damn. Nice. Middle my shout outs or whatever yeah. uh, shout out Brian Beto that's right shout out Maple Alley shout out everybody who's been following us and sharing all their stuff with like all of our things you know us included right you and me <laughs> right uh, six followers uh, <laughs> six <laughs> listeners <laughs> Uh, and with that being said, I'm going to pass on my shout outs to Johnny. I, uh, I just want to give a big shout out to Katie and Michael again for doing the whole setup. A big shout out to Saul yeah. for pulling up. Those fucking spiders yeah. are kicking her ass, bro. And <laughs> I know, but it should be getting stuck to me. Yeah. Um, and uh, just a big shout out to all my homies that are here, pulled up. Yeah. And uh, just a big shout out to everybody that was here and another happy birthday to Dreams. And Thank you. And uh, we're, we're going to party it up later. We're going to have fun. Where's right. your birthday today? It's okay. actually tomorrow. Oh, hell yeah. Happy birthday. <laughs> no, it was on Monday. It was on Monday. It was on Monday. It was on Monday. It was on I was trying to get an episode. <laughs> Come on. Uh, it's just you and I and friends? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, bro, put me on, bro. I got you. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Hey, I'll get my people to talk yeah, to your people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Beto, you got, you got a shout out, Beto? Yeah. Oh, was it done? Uh, Are you not done? No, I, I, I want to give a shout out to my parents for listening because I, I know they're listening. For my cousins. They're yeah, no, to my cousins in Mexico. I don't know what you're saying. Yeah, they do. Kind of, kind of. I, I whatever. Uh, a big shout to, to my friends, uh, to Jenny, Nora, and all my friends that were listening. Thank you so much. Shout out to Jesse, and that's it. Mm-hmm. I want to give a big shout out to my girl. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Sam. Shout out. Fuck you, bro. <laughs> Sam, bro. Uh, shout out to every. Fuck. No, you know what? Fuck everybody that fucking makes fun of me. Fuck everybody that's that <laughs> fucking nervous on the podcast, man. Fuck you. Uh, you shake your ass, bro. I, sh- I want to give a big shout out to Gazelle, Lalo, Johnny, Saul, Dreams. Uh-huh. Shout out to my girl Shout out to everybody That's subscribing to my YouTube channel Bro we're so close to 500 It's Let's crazy go. Yeah. 500k uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Hey. Visualization Yeah, yeah so sh- uh, Shout out to everybody That follows me on Instagram And um, shout out to all, j- all the truckers yeah. Yo. For second family. Uh, yeah, my yeah, shout out my lady as well. Shout out Halloween is fucking pulling up. It's coming up. Saka to Halloween ski. Uh, um, you guys drop some stories on our voicemail inbox again. If you guys want, you guys still have one more week to do it. What's the number? Dreams. Nine oh nine five four. Six? Seven. <laughs> five four seven fifty five forty six. There it is. I don't know yeah. five four seven fifty five forty six. If you guys have any spooky stories, go ahead and drop them in the inbox, and then yeah. you guys might get the chance to get them played next week on next week's episode. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Got anybody you want to shout out? So, Plug your shout out to all the hoes. <laughs> That'll do it. Shout out Miami. Shout out Miami. Uh, thank you guys for having me on. It was a great time. I was yeah. looking forward for this for a while. Yeah, I'm yeah. glad I was a. Uh, I was able to vent. Thank you guys for letting me vent, giving me the yeah. space, yeah. safe space. Imagine we didn't do that, right? Like a gun on him, just talking shit the whole time. Yeah. Well, this was actually my make a wish. Imagine, <laughs> imagine Gazelle cuts it all out. Yeah, uh, right. It just makes it just like I my hate words. these people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you guys uh, for uh, letting me on. It was a fun time. Thank you guys for everybody who's watching. Uh, Ponte las pilas, I and your friends collab coming in November. So oh, stay tuned. Cool. Yeah. See you all there. Yeah, so it's gonna be a fun time. Uh, what else is got handles? On hand. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, Saul V Gomez on everything, mm-hmm. and I E and friends, and then besties and all that stuff. Yeah, let's go. You know where to Thanks. find them. Uh, yeah. Shout out to you again for pulling up. Shout out to you for giving me the call. You know, talking to me and stuff like that, so we can talk prior to this. That was pretty dope. Yeah. Shout out to your whole team. Can't wait to do a second part with hopefully you know Aaron and Caesar. For sure, for sure. And then all the you know get the best. Get the, get the besties side. Get the too. besties on Ponte Las Pilas. Get, get besties over Uh-oh. here. Get Bueno Bueno, the homie Rex. I know Rex from from high school. That was cool as fuck. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, but yeah, I mean hopefully. And we'll get Brian Beto on yours. Yeah. We'll, <laughs> that helps. Oh we'll, uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll toss you these for the yeah. yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> but uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> shout out right. shout out to you again. I think this is pulling up. Uh 
shout out to all the homies here shout out to all the truck drivers all the landscapers everybody that we always shout out every fucking week yeah um big things coming <laughs> everybody everybody who doesn't have big things coming <laughs> yeah. big things coming <laughs> smaller things coming <laughs> moving in silence yeah. moving in silence uh but yeah shout out to the homies shout out to the uh, halloween costume party we're going to later that'll be fun uh good luck to you tonight and tomorrow at your shows yes sir your comedy shows that you're doing you, you got what you got tonight yeah tonight chicano comedy festival pull up and, and then tomorrow oh, yeah. <laughs> it'll be too late but what, what, I, I got another one at the laugh factory in november or something I'll promote that then with that no, no, i forgot the no, name. november something actually super ego is going to be there too if you guys want to see super ego. damn hey, now that you're talking about super ego bro, let, let him know what's up bro. <laughs> let him know what's up and then some, november 16 laugh factory yeah no, that's right laugh factory. Yeah. and then on uh it's gonna be too late for you to go, but on Sunday, yeah, yeah. You know, you're going to Ontario. Ontario Improv. Improv. Yeah, yeah. We, we wish you so well. So good luck, thank good you, luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, And uh, yeah, shout out the boys, shout out my girl, shout out my family. And with that, we out. Peace. 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 Peace.